There we are. Says we're live. Says we're here. Let's see it how does. long it takes. <laughs> Look right. at Paula's. Yippee. So let's see. <laughs> Paula's here. Lisa's here. Kathy's here. Angie's here. I know Jamie is here. Michelle's here. You hear Maggie over there. There's Louise and Tammy. Oh my gosh. Oh, and the iPad popped on real early too. Maybe we have good things in store for lag, you guys. My maybe my phone isn't even showing live yet. Let me uh -oh. Mine went on in seconds. It was probably because I was already on there. Could be. Could be. Hey Candy. hey, Candy. So we promised you guys textiles tonight. All I can say it's is now. Thursday. Holy cow. Maggie is going to knock your guys' socks off. That's all I got to say. Yep. No pressure. <laughs> no pressure, Mags. Yeah, Mags. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Paula. Uh-uh. Hey, Michelle with two L's. That's a whole story. Hey, Michelle. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we got to watch Paula and the mute button, you guys. She's having serious issues with her mute button. <laughs> That's all I got to say. If we're talking and we hear nothing from Paula, somebody please tell her to turn her mic on. Turn her speakers on, not her mic, her speakers. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So what's everybody's weather like? We, I know, I said I wasn't going to do it, and I did. It's habit now. Um, it was windy, and, like, I lost my internet twice today. So... If we lose internet tonight, um, hey, Judy. hey, Judy, give us a chance in the chat to tell you if I'm coming back here or if we're going to switch to Maggie's. If we if we get kicked off twice, the second time for sure, we're going to move this um, over to Maggie's channel. Um, the first time we'll just come back here. But if it does happen twice, we will go to Maggie's. Or if I can't get back in the first time, then we'll go straight to Maggie's. So give us a chance in the chat. So don't anybody, you know, if you want to know what the plan is, hang out in the chat and we'll, because the chat will stay up, I think. If I get knocked out, it'll stay for a couple minutes. Hey, Jude. Hey, Jude. How are you? Hi, Jude. 60 in Colorado. Nine. If you want to springtime in Ohio today. Wow. Right? See, that's the weather we had yesterday. It was beautiful, right? Yeah, it was a really nice day. Sunshine felt good. Mm -hmm. Nice change. Oh my gosh, you guys, I got to share this with you. So Michelle and I went down like memory hood lane from our childhood. Does anybody else eat Robin egg at Easter time? Yes. I'm like all about chocolate, right? But like for like legit candy candy this is like the only thing that i it's it's so weird it's like i'm instantly eight years old again every year at easter time love them yep Ooh, icky lisa that's no fun and Ugh. tiffany hey tiffany hey jody <clears throat> hey jody nice hello ladies so we're just going to hang out and chit chat for a couple minutes and then we're going to have Maggie start right in. Um, I'm going to have Maggie start because I want to shop too, because I know what's coming. Um, and then when Maggie's done, then I'll come back and I've got this stuff. Oh, I know what I wanted to ask you guys. See, Michelle, it does me no good to have a game plan because I instantly go off the rails. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. not even saying a word. I know. I heard you. So what, okay, I know some of you girls really know your laces. Hey, Louise, what is this, what is like the technical actual name of this kind of lace? And if we don't know now, I'm going to ask again later. It's gorgeous. It is gorgeous, right? Yeah, it's beautiful. But I don't hey, know, Melissa. like, hey, Melissa, I Hi, just Melissa. don't know what it actually really is called like if I went to a lace store and wanted this, what what I you can't just walk in and say, oh, I want to see a gorgeous lace because they got a whole shop full of it, right? So I'm trying really hard to learn more about laces because I feel like I know enough to be dangerous, but I don't like I'm not like 
really could be know. Venice people. place. I don't know. See, I just don't know. I don't know how. I don't know how to tell just by looking at it. And that's that's what I, the little flowers around the sides almost look like tatting with the little. Um, right. Exactly. But see, it really <laughs> is. And it's, I mean, it's not dainty. It's so sturdy and it's nice. And um, like where all the embroidered edges is really nice. Yeah, no, it's not applique. It's not mm. an applique, but it's just, I mean, it really is pretty. I just don't know what it is. Mm. And so I've been going down this little rabbit trail learning about bobbin thread. Holy cow. Who knew this is bobbin thread? Do you guys, and if you guys all know this and want me to be quiet, then just say, we already know. Um, but like, this is this is bobbin. That looks bobbin really ring. old, doesn't it? It's so pretty, yeah. so pretty. And what I'm learning about the bobbin lace is, even though this looks super fragile, it's actually incredibly sturdy because it's more woven, like a woven texture. So, um, and of course, I've lost all the words, and I didn't write any of the terminology down. But this is also bobbin lace. And look at the difference between this and the last one. So then there's that. And Maggie was helping out with research. What did you find out about when they made the machines, Maggie? Do you remember? Um, 1809, the machine was invented for, um, you know, for machine made bobbin laces and, uh, and other laces too, not just bobbin. Right. So... I think that's part of the reason that it's so confusing trying to figure out what's handmade and what's machine made because like the trim on this one, this tiny little trim here, that's a bobbin lace, but this is not. This is an embroidery because it goes through on both sides. That's gorgeous. Isn't that mm -hmm. pretty? And there's just yeah. a small piece of it. You know, I would love to have found yards and yards of it, but of course I didn't. But it's like this bobbin lace thing it just never ends. There's just, and this is a bobbin lace. I'm not sure, Paula. I forget where it said he was. But isn't that gorgeous? It is. It's just, it's crazy to me. And then this piece is obviously a handmade, like that other wide white one that I showed that was a bobbin. But I mean, this one you can just, you can just tell, I think. And it's white, so it's not. I don't think this is incredibly old. I just think this is leaning toward the vintage side of things. So, but I mean, it's still pretty. Right. And well, well they've been using the machines. If they've been using them since, the, you know, the early 1800s, then there can be machine made antique laces now. Right. Right. And this, I don't think this is 100% cotton. I feel like this is a blended one. You can feel the cotton in it, but it doesn't. It's not soft like you would expect 100% cotton to feel. So I think that one's blended. But then look at this, like that that netting and this. Oh. I know mm -hmm. this this is bobbin, but I don't. This is not. This is an embroidered. See the little? Oh, nope, you can't. There. Right. No, it was no. probably attached mm -hmm. after. Yeah. But I don't even know what, what would this possibly be for? There's three little, there, now you can kind of see it. There's three little scallops and the, on the bottom and then the two. So it's like, I don't even know what this thing would be used for. And there's two of them. It is so pretty and so delicate looking, but it's just, you know, and then this even one. The cutouts and they're supposed to be used later for like trim on uh, collars or napkins or something. Mm -hmm. Oh, that could be. <laughs> and then this Ooh, one is blank. It's also. That's really pretty. That's this pretty one nice. I feel like is handmade because Maggie and I were talking before we came on that like one of the ways we typically tell if things are or can tell if things are machine made or handmade is if if you don't see any mistakes, this one, you can see a little bit of variance in some of the, and I, I don't even, they're not stitches. So I don't even know what you would call it, but you can see a little bit of variance in it. So I feel like this one was probably handmade. So it, can you, I just, the, the time that went into this, 
but I look at all of like that play stitch. Yeah, right. But it's just if you go and watch some of the, and there's some videos on YouTube too, but there's just so much out there that it's like I feel like I could spend the rest of my life learning about bobbin lace. <coughs> Well, then you have the different countries too, like laces in Switzerland, um, your Irish laces that they're called Clooney laces. Mm -hmm. um, French. The Germans probably have their, you know, their own. Right. Lace. I feel like, yeah, I feel like lace is like paper. It's like the more you learn, the more you realize you don't know and how much more is left to learn. So, I'm kind of delving into it. So, hey, Natasha. So if I'm I go, ahead, yeah. So anytime we're doing laces, or if I find a really cool piece and I bring it, and I go off on a rant, just bring me back. Just bring me back. Say, Patty, we really don't care. Just come back. <laughs> so lace might be, you know, one of my new. Oh, and did you guys know that they have these whole like. There's all different kinds of them, but mostly it was like this. Um, they almost look like a pulpit almost, but it's a pillow that they would use to do the um, the bobbin lace on because they would pin it as they were weaving to help hold shape and hemlines and things like that. Um, I actually found one, like a legit real one. And there was somebody had put lace and the bobbins, you know, the bobbins were still attached to the lace. Um, but they had pinned it on there and it was really, really super cool to actually see it. It helped you get a perspective of size. So that was kind of cool. So I, I know I'm goofy, Jamie. I get excited about the weirdest things. I know. Breathing. Who breathes? Jeez Louise. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Yeah. And it's just, I don't know. I just, I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I really, I just really want to take the time to educate myself on lace because there's just, there's so, so much. And Michelle, say the one that starts with a G that I can never say properly. You better shut your face. Goupier. No, I'm serious. I'm the one that always trips over it. Say it. Goupier. Thank you. Jude was wondering if that's what Jude thought maybe that's what this was. UBAM. See, yeah, and I'm, I'm not sure what the difference is between that and what they call Venice or Venice lace, but mm -hmm. they're close. Right. That's so, just yum. It is yummy, right? So yep, it's nice, sturdy, and I like that one. Right. So, but anyway, yeah. Um, I'm not even going to tell you what I have. You can see what's here. Um, Mags, are you ready? We'll switch over to you. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to, okay. listen, we're just like, okay. So I'm going to switch over to Maggie. Maggie's going to get started. Um, I'll be in and out as far as the mic goes. I, right, Kathy? Exactly. I am. I am really going to take the time to like dig into this because I really want to understand. If I'm going to keep finding it and bringing it, then I want more knowledge about what I'm bringing. So still see old French ladies in Florence. Do I know that was one of the videos I found and watched. It's just, and their hands just fly. And how they remember that. It's nuts. They're like, doo -doo 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 -doo, like nunchucks. I know it's crazy. <laughs> Absolutely. Give me one crazy. Second, Patty. Yeah. I'll give you a second. I'll keep rambling. Till they tell me to zip it. Let's see. Right? Yeah. And there's a lot of, um, <clears throat> from what I found, they still make a lot of the bobbin lace um, by hand in India, too. And those women, holy cow. Mm -hmm. They get those things to fly in. I would have nothing but a knot. An absolute, and I don't think I have any interest in trying to learn how to make it. I just want to know how it's made and which ones are what, because it really, really frustrates me that I don't know, like, what this, I mean, is it just embroidery or is it something specific? And it does look, this is definitely a machine <laughs> embroidered, but like this, I want to know what that's called. I, I just, I want to know. 
Uh oh, Judy has a lace book. Yeah, you better, Judy, because you can give me tutorials from chat. That would work. That would be super cool. I was hoping Lori would be here early because Lori does lots with lace. There's a couple of the ladies that I feel like would definitely have some knowledge about all of this. We'll have to do more research now. Uh -huh. Ooh, that's pretty, Maggie. Can I show them what's on the table? Oh, yeah. I'm, also, I'm sorry. I'm, I just wanted to show up. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, you guys. Oh, excuse me. Get ready. Here it comes. Look at that. Oh, my. How pretty oh. is that? I, feel like I can't even look, look at my phone because the lag is so long. I can't say it three times fast. Lisa, Michelle told me I have to breathe. There's no way I could do it fast and breathe. <laughs> it would never work. All right, so I have some by the yard laces, and this one I have, Michelle, I have six yards available. Oh, I got to put you one in there. Yard. And they're it's, one yard a piece, right? What's that? You, They're one yard each, right? Yes, it's per yard. Gotcha. And for anybody that's new, I just put the ticker up with Maggie's email address. So if you could just shoot her an email like you do me, if you haven't shopped with her before, then she'll be able to get your invoices to you. And I'm not going to leave that up there the whole time. I'll just leave it long enough for you guys to get it and get it written down or whatever. It's not really that obtrusive. It's kind of skinny. Yeah, okay. it is. It is. It isn't bad. All right. So um, it's going to be four yard uh four dollars a yard and i have six yards available and i just call this a, a flower dangle lace and it's i think it's mainly caught it might be a cotton blend but it does um take dye and yes, so when you're ready michelle will just be the um for six me's, or do you, you want a limit on this, or you don't care? Um, What's up, B? How you doing? No, because hey, I, I have I have others too, so um, okay. I I think it'll be okay. Maggie's not doing measurements tonight. Sorry, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Carla. <coughs> All right, that is sold. Hey, Mary. You let me know when you're ready. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Hi, Mary. Hi, Kim. Okay. Uh, Mary Siever, one. Okay. Paula, two. Okay. Kim Stevenson, one. Hey, Kim. Okay. Michelle Hartley, one. Okay. Is that Michelle with two L's? It is Michelle with two L's. Okay. Oh, it's spelled properly. You better. Wang. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's Hi, frisky, y'all. Hi, Tamar. Hi, Tamar. You're stuck with ladies. all three of us tonight, you guys. Yeah. Okay. And um, these will all be, these, I have four more mich different ones, Michelle. They'll all be $4 a yard. And this is a wide rose oh, lace. Oh, shit. Oh, no. And it's, um, it's oh. a very light beige. I don't know if the color's coming through, but, and it's an embroidered. Oh, And I have four yards available of this one. Again, Maggie's not getting a measurements, people. So get it and like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great word for me, Sandy. Thank you. Yes, unique. Those are sold. Okay. <laughs> oh, and ready. look who gets one. Beige. 
<laughs> All right. Um, ready? Yep. Okay. Mary Seaver, one. Okay. Kathy Beige, one. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Okay. Tammy Minda, one. Hi, Tammy. You guys are getting good stuff. Thank you, ladies. I'll give you proper names, Meg, because, you know. Because, you know. Because, you know. You know. <laughs> you know. So, Tammy, like right now, I got to call you Tammy instead of Minda. <laughs> Okay, let's see. All right, the next one, I only have two yards available and it's in it's white. And it's another wide wow. one. Oh, how pretty. That's pretty. Ooh, camera doesn't like oh, it. Oh, so doesn't like it. Bad. Well, can, hmm. just, just keep, there you go. Just a little bit. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Now it's you can happy. still see it, right? Yep. 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 That's nice. Maggie, if you had to guess, how wide is that one? Oh, I've got a ruler right here. Um, let's see. It's seven inches wide. That's beautiful. I'm looking. One, two, three, four. I can see six different ways to cut that. <clears throat> right. Those are sold. Okay. Yeah. Valerie, your hope helped. Okay. <laughs> um, I pray. <laughs> did you hear? Did you say, I hope? I hope. <laughs> uh, one is going to Mary Seaver and the other is going to Paula Fowler. Okay. Then Thank came you. Lisa, then came Kathy, my soul, Michelle Hartley, and Kim. After my soul. Might help you guys gauge your leg there. I know when we came on, I, I was 15 seconds. And this one, I only have um, two yards available, and it's okay. another wide. Oh, pretty. Jeez. All right, now I can tell you it is, it's about five and three quarters wide. Beautiful. And this is also beige. It's a it's a very well actually it might even be considered cream, I guess. Look how soft and supple it is. It's pretty. It can be cut one, two, three, four. It can be cut like four different ways. No, five going that way. Mm -hmm. Lots of possibilities. Hey, Melanie. Oh, my. That is so... Hey, Melanie. Hi, Melanie. Two, correct? Yes. Okay. Lisa Jameson and Melanie. Thank you, Melanie. Melanie's last name is L. <laughs> Melanie L. Okay. Correct. That's great. Okay, and then the last one is, I guess it, you could call it a bridal trim, but it doesn't have to be. Oh, this is white. My goodness. It has pearls, um, bugle beads. Oh, I that? just looked up. <gasps> and I have six yards of this available. Oh, how much is this one, Maggie? Uh, four. Okay. Wow. Yeah, these can, you can cut them. You can, if you want, you can fussy cut them or, you know, you can cut them individually. Oh my goodness. Look how far back my leg is. Oh, yeah, but you didn't get that line. Okay. So I guess I, All right, I have my I have my chat frozen. So I can't your bottom, but this is sold. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, Candy Boyer with a, with K? a K. Okay. Yep. 
One. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Okay. Mary Sieber, one. Okay. Paul Fowler, one. Okay. Melanie L, one. Hi, Shauna. Okay. Hey, Shauna. And Tammy Mendo, one. Okay. Next was Patty, Shauna, my sold, then Kim, then Kathy. I'm going to have to figure out what that advice to use, that's for sure. Pretty. Okay, now I have um, some $3 laces. Okay, this is still by the yard? By the yard, yep. Okay, gotcha. Just grab them here. Okay, I have four yards available of this one. And this is another cream color one. Oh my gosh. And it's oh. really, really soft. Bring oh, that's one. really pretty. I don't know about you guys, but I just want to go sleep in Maggie's room for like <laughs> two days. I just want to go look at it all and touch it all. Did you say you had six available? Uh, I have four available of this one. Or available of that one? Yes. Hey, Journey. Hi, Journey. Wow. Hi, Journey. I just called that cream yum because that is yummy. Are you serious? That is old. Big time. Whoa. Okay. Oh, Ready? look who's right at the top there. Mm hmm. I Ready? switched devices. Yep. Patty Lang won. Hippie. Is that with an L? <laughs> um, <it is. laughs> okay, <It> ready? <laughs> P-A-T-T-Y, yes. <laughs> Lisa Jameson. Okay. Hey, Rosie. And Kathy Beige. Who was number three? Kathy Beige. Oh, I thought you said and Kathy Beige. Patty, Lisa, and Kathy. Patty, Lisa, Kathy. Correct. Oh, you have four, right? I have four. Yep. Okay. And Kim Stevenson. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Oh, sorry, Kim. I didn't mean to make you sweat that out. <laughs> yes, she did. Yes, she did. <laughs> okay. Oh, Tammy, I forgot to tell you, thanks for the shout out, by the way. You're welcome, Kim. All right, and then <laughs> I, have, I have three yards available of this one. You have three of them available? Of this one, yes, three. Okay. And this is, it's not white, white. It's kind of between white and cream. Maybe an ivory. And it could be an ivory. Oh, I'm calling that. And you have three available? And three available. Those are sold. When you're after my soul, really. <laughs> You know, on okay. my device, it does not show that. I'm just saying. Okay. Do we need to have this? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Those are you ready? Yep. Okay. Uh, you have three available. They're going to Kathy Beige, Lisa Jameson, and Kim Stevenson. Thank you, ladies. I'll say it with some pep, Kim. Hey, Sharon. How are you? Hi, Hi Sharon. Sharon. Okay. And I have three of this available. 
Let me get the right. Oh, how pretty. Ooh. And this is a really light beige. It's That's really like nice. Angle, right? Oh, one, two, three, four ways I could cut. Oh, five, actually, I see. Wow. Beautiful. It is sold. Um, that is going to go to Lisa Jameson, mm -hmm. Mary Siever, mm -hmm. Michelle with two L's Hartley. Thank you, ladies. Okay. And I have six yards of this one available. And this is an embroidered trim and it's it's white oh my goodness that's really pretty thank you no you're not limited journey you can get as many as you want Hey, Lorna. Hi, Lorna. So you had six of these available? Yes. Are you ready? I'm ready. Kim Stevenson, one. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Okay. Kathy Beige, one. Okay. Tammy Minder, two. Okay. That leaves one available. If nobody else wants it, I'll take it. Put Lang down for the last one. Okay. Well, you know, Lillian informed me she needed new princess dresses, so I have to gather lace. All right. That is so, 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 so okay. sorry. That <laughs> <laughs> looks so, so, so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and then this is the last one. And there's six yards of this available. And this is like a almost like a really light butter color. It's not yellow, but it's it's like butter. yeah, it's like a a really light butter color. It's got angled at the end. That's really pretty. I I this look like like Feathers. I like mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. It's different. Mm. I'm just making up my own language for this. <laughs> Maggie, on that last one where Tammy got two. Yep. Yeah. She would like to know if you'd mail one to Linda Carruthers from her. Okay. She does, doesn't she, Lorna? So um, y'all know that there's one left of this. You ready, Mags? Uh, just one second. I just want to make sure so I don't forget that. Okay. You let me know. <clears throat> Okay. All right. Mary Seaver, one. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Okay. Paula, one. Okay. Kathy Beige, one. Okay. Melanie L, one. Okay. Kathy, one available. Okay. Nobody, Thank you, ladies. I'll take the last one. And the last one goes again to Lang. Okay. 
I think I'm just going to keep doing it this way. Yeah, we'll let them have first <laughs> leftovers. I'll pick those up. You got it. Okay. Now the next thing I have. is I have, I made up, let's see, I think I made up one, two, I made up four of these, but they're, they're going to be different, but they're just, they're bags of trims and they're at least, be, they're between one to two yards, some are like a yard and a half, but they're at least a yard each. And they're all neutral. There's like white, they might be white, beige, um, cream, but no, no colors. Oh so I was going to do these random because, you know, you're basically getting, oh my goodness. What do think oh show? My random. And there's at least eight yards in each one. Holy cow. Yes, please. It's like lace ribbon. Okay, so you have bags of trim, uh, four of them available. Right. $15 each. Good luck, ladies. Whew. Oh my god. And if anybody if anybody wants them too, as long as they you know they don't mind that they're random, I can make more. But I didn't want to make too many ahead of time. <laughs> um, you're you gonna have to make some more mags. Yeah, you're gonna have to start a, a an extra list. <laughs> yeah, you want me to just give you everybody who chimed in? Yeah, yeah. Why don't you do that? Okay. You let me know when you're ready. Okay, ready. Hi, David. Um, Lisa Jameson one. Okay. Kathy Beige one. Okay. Journey Stoneman, one. Okay. Mary Siever, one. Okay. Tammy Minda, one. Okay. Kim Stevenson, one. Okay. Shauna Henson, one. Okay. That's all I have. Nice. Those are beautiful. Hi, Sherilyn. Hey, Sherilyn. Hi, Sherilyn. Hello. Those are gorgeous. Hey, David. Okay. Those off to the side. That's yes, great. Beautiful, Maggie. Beautiful. Thank you. Okay. And for those who come back and rewatch, Maggie, just get a hold of her and she can make more. Um, Sandy Garrett would like on that list, please. Sandy? Yes. Okay. That's not a very convincing. I'm okay, Sherilyn. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. It's Textile Thursday. Okay. Yep. Two more. I have, nope. I have some bridal Can stuff you please here. Put two more bags down. Say that again. Natasha. Can you put two bags down for Natasha, please? Okay. I'm serious. I just want to go play at Maggie's for a day. I just want to sit on the floor and have things thrown at me. Right? These are, I only have one of these. Oh, dear. And God. they're bridal hem. <laughs> it's a bridal hem grab bag. I'll take them out so you can. Almost see. swore. 
Did you say bridal hem? Bridal hems, right. Only one. Okay. This this one's I, this one I can't even get all in, but it's um it's like I think it's a yard, and this is what it looks like. It's amazing. That's what it is. Look at that. And oh it's stitched. So when when you go to cut it, you just have to put a little um, hot glue or Fabri-Tac. You know, just so that when you cut, you don't lose any of the pearls. There's pearls, there's clear sequins, there, there's also this these type of pearls, the oval ones. Hi, Arena. And then it goes it goes all, all the way up there. Do you guys ever look at these trims and wonder what the whole dress looked like? Yes. When I don't get the whole dress, I do. Yeah. Well, Dave, mm -hmm. if you do, we wouldn't mind a photo. Just kidding. <laughs> okay. And then I think there's a yard of this one, too. Oh, I, I like that. I started to fussy cut, and my hands just won't. But there's, I think there's a whole yard of this one. So pretty. Mm. So I was going to fun life on a budget. Is that Robin? No, that's no. Marina. Dang it. I'll get it one of these days. Robin is second chance. That's Robin. Robin is second chance. Correct. Hey, Arena. And this is more than half a yard. And this oh. is champagne color. I know it, you probably won't be able to tell. Um, oh, you, you can see it good. Can you see that it's champagne? Mm -hmm. Compared to the other piece that's laying right beside it. Oh, yeah. Right. right. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, that's lovely. And then this is just, there's no beading on it, but you can, you can add them if you want. It's an embroidered one. And there's like a yard of this or close, close to a yard. So that's this one, and I only have one of them, and it'll be um, 25. Wow. Michelle. Uh, let's see who gets it. If anybody's that's interested. It's sold to Melanie L. Okay. Nice. Thank you, Melanie. Melanie. And then I have some other ones. They're not hems, they're appliques. Yeah, there was no slow that time, was there, David? I agree. There was no slow pony involved that time. All right, so I have two of these available, and and they're app their bridal gown appliques. And there's a, there might be a couple that are the same, but but they'll be different too. There's there's this one in this bag, and then there's hey Deb, this one. They're just they're all they're just all different. There's some with cut work. Oh. My goodness. Oh my God. And again, now this goes, this one here is from that one with the hem. This is one of the appliques that was on the dress. There might be a couple of those in here, I'm not sure. And there's this one. Oh. And these you just have to fussy cut. There's this one. Yeah, there's a, there's another one here with the little bead underneath it. Yes, she does, Jamie. It's absolutely gorgeous. You would just love it. Her room is gorgeous. 
there's another one and there's a piece and then there is this large piece here. Hopefully you can see it. It's sparkly. Yeah, there, it's like clear bugle beads. There's tiny, tiny little um, seed beads. Mm -mm. So I have um, two of these. The other one is, it's it's basically the same, only some of the appliques are different, but they're all bridal appliques. Same but different? Say that again? Same but different? Same but different. I mean, I can show if you want. No, it's okay. Same but different. Okay. Yeah. We trust you. So there's two of those available, and these are 15 each. Whoa. <laughs> Get locked and loaded, ladies. What? 15 each. sold in like two seconds oh my word oh my word i don't know oh. if you make more of these mags hey, okay i'm ready whenever you are hey laura um melanie l and okay. sandy garrett sandy thank you ladies mm-hmm Wow, that is wow. Now I have two smaller ones too. These were the large, a larger bag. I have two small bags. Okay. Oh, hey, and the same with the small bags. They're the same but different. Two as well. Two as well. Yep. Okay, they both have one of these again. And I'll show you this one. This has this piece here. There's this piece. There's actually two appliques in one. And this one. There's this one. I know, Natasha, you did not. And there's this one. You were right after Sandy. You were third. Okay, so I have two of these, Michelle, and these are going to be $7 each. Okay. All right. I need the room. <laughs> Beautiful. Is your soul? Okay. Kathy Bays and Teresa Petro, you came in to me for. Um, those are sold to Lisa Jameson and Sean Hansen. Thank you, ladies. Okay, let's see what what I have next. I figured, um, Kathy. We're gonna do an auction. Oh, let me get my phone. It's on the charger. Oh, okay. I have a really old cigar box with some surprises in there. Oh, beautiful box. Okay. Um, So there's a yard of this trim here. This is white. And there's a yard of this trim. And this is cream color. 
Is that like an oversized cigar box? Look at all that stuff. And then there is, I love these old cigar boxes. And then there's this one. This isn't, this is more like a half a yard or so of this one. But you can cut them individually if you wanted to. And then there's, this is hand, this was handmade. Wow. And it's a cream color. Oh my gosh. Is that like a shawl? No, it's it's a like a table runner. Oh. Hold on one second. I wear the Walmart. You're right? That's beautiful. <laughs> As a babushka even. Mmm. Mmm. Hey Carla. Hey Carla. That's beautiful, Maggie. Well, probably um, not quite a yard long. And then I have ah, some bling. Some bling. Look, and then I have some bling. And the bling will be put in individual plastic bags. But just so I could show it, I, I left the pieces out. So, and these are, this is a pin. These are metal. They're all metal. There's no plastic. Beautiful. This is a pen. This is a pen. <laughs> this is a pen. That looks so pretty on a page. And then there's this piece, which is, I think it's a foot long. And then there's this piece. Whoops. Oh my. Hey, Deidre. That's pretty. Hi, Deidre. Oh my gosh. That is really pretty. Yeah, I like and that. And then one. this is a pin. Oh, wow, Maggie. That trim, that, that one you pulled out with the flowers on it, that is, I've never seen anything like that. That's really different. I with love the loop it. at the bottom and it's yeah, like, that's, that sheer. Yeah, this I love that. Rhinestones. And it can be cut too. This is a this is a mesh, but it can be cut with that's Timmy's scissors. Gorgeous. So like I said, they'll be put in plastic, in little plastic bags, but I wanted to leave them out so they could be seen. So I'm not going to even try to put it back the way I did. I'll do that after. Starting so this is an option, Michelle. Hmm? Starting and, at. Uh, excuse me. Starting at. Um, let's start it at ten. I'll leave it. Mm -mm -mm. Put it. I'm going to sit on my hands and try to behave. That one trim is just outstanding. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I might, Jamie. I might. Well, see, that's what I'm afraid of, Louise. It's like, do I really put them all the way under there and then lose all the thing feeling in all of my fingers, or do I just? I'm like, oh. So currently, I'm actually holding my coffee cup with both hands. Maybe that will be in check. You can see my hands. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I keep voting me number one, you guys. <laughs> You're I'm not supposed to so pull pulling me. She just voted. Yeah. <laughs> You're not supposed to say that. Oh, my God. <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, you know, this being the fifth wheel thing, this is kind of fun. I'm liking it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, Angie's making journals. Good for you. Oh, good. You're going to put up pictures of them for us, right? I love when you guys post pictures. Because I'm a slacker. I never seem to get very many pictures up. If you guys notice that, I like you don't see anything. And then all of a sudden, I bombard you. And then I forget to put any up again. <laughs> right, Angie? Uh-oh, halt. 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 That is sold to Laura Taylor Artsy 7 Studios for $38. Nice job, Laura. Thank you, Very Laura. nice. Very nice. Right, Jody, the paper bag, but I know I would cheat and cut eye holes in it, so it would serve me no purpose. Yeah, that's the timer. That's Michelle's timer. <laughs> yep, that's my uh, alarm. <laughs> Laura would like you to send her the bill and give the box to Patty. Wow, that was okay. That's Thank you. very sweet. Very sweet, Laura. Thank you very much. That's, I don't even know what to say. Thank you just sounds so, ah, so pretty. Thank you very much. Oh, well, but I like, but, but the upside is I love what I do. I really do. And sometimes I forget that I'm working. And I know that sounds like a stick or something, but I really do love what I do. And it shows. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it does. Oh, Deidre, I bet. Are you in the group? Can you put pictures over there? I have a couple more surprises, too. Oh, Maggie, you, everything you have tonight is beautiful. <laughs> Seriously. Okay, I have three of these. They're they're all they're fabric flowers. Oh, I seen the oh yeah. You did. <laughs> and there's over fifty flowers. This yes. and and there's at least three of each. This is um pink. The flower itself is pink. So there's that. Maggie, yeah. hold that one up. Hold that one up. That first one. Hold that one up real close again. She sent me that one, you guys. It is absolutely beautiful. I have one of those. They're gorgeous. You have three available of these, right? I have three available. Oh my gosh. Just wait, okay. wait. I saw this the other night. There's I haven't seen this one. Six of these roses. These are embroidered. And th there's three of these. This is with the white background. So they're like the pink only, only, well, no, actually they are a little different. This has pearls. This has these little stems. Okay. Then there's three of these with pearls and um, sequins, the dangles. Thank you, Paula. There's oh, five of Thanks, these. Paul. I just went and grabbed it. There's three <laughs> of these, and these are appliques. You can um, cut them, but there's three of these, and these are cream color, and they're really, really soft. Mm -hmm. Then there's three of these, and you can fussy cut these, and then fussy cut this, and you can put it on top, and then a a little bling piece and I've done that with those in uh, fabric books. Then there's Love these that. with the little pearl and they're double layered. Now see Melanie, these would be the better ones. These would be Melanie's making pasties. <laughs> 
these have pearls. That looks soft. And you you don't have to worry about them. You can, as long as you cut in those lines there, they won't come off. And there's three of these. These are pink. If you can tell, they're pink and they have pearls in the middle. And there's these that there's five of these, and you can cut these <laughs> individually. There's three of these black ones, and these are uh, double. There's five of these. Mm -hmm. There's one of these. Mm -hmm. Maggie, Maggie will, Laura. Three of those. These three of those. Thanks, Jude. And three of those. They're all the same. The three of them are the same. And these are $20 each. You have three of them, correct? I have three. And there's over 50, like I said, there's over 50 flowers. Nine. That is pretty sure. Nine. Just and that's my math is wrong, which could happen. It's so pretty. Who cares about the math thing? Hi, Jean. Hi, Jean. Jinx. <laughs> oh, those are sold. Oh my, yep, those are sold. Ready? Okay, ready. Jeremy Stoneman. Hey, Jennifer. Uh, okay. Melanie L. Okay. And Kathy Beige. Thanks, ladies. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. You missed everything. Hey, you know Jane? But it's early, so, you know, there's more coming. Okay. <laughs> Melanie, you're killing me. Oh my gosh. Lauren Taylor, I don't know if you heard me answer you, honey. Um, Maggie will send you an invoice. She does through PayPal and I do through Square. So if um if Maggie doesn't have your info, if you don't mind, I'll just give it to her. And that that goes for any of you. If you forget to send her an email and I have your information, don't stress out. I'll make sure she gets it. If Pad doesn't have it, I probably do. I can yeah. help you. Yeah, we usually don't switch and share everybody's information, but as long as we're discussing it and everybody's okay with it, then I will. Okay, I have snippet grab bags again. Oh, here we go. Oh my gosh, you guys. And I will. I only made this one, Looks but I'll just kind of show you an example for anybody that hasn't seen them before. And pay attention to what Maggie considers a snippet, okay? Seriously. Mm -hmm. Well, what I do is whatever is left after I've used it on a project or if I've used it several times, you might get a piece like this. <laughs> yeah, it's like, you know, just a yard long. It's a yard snippet. snippet. <laughs> These snippet. There's little fl there's flowers. There can be embroidered, you know, pieces of embroidered trim. And I just fill this bag. So I know some of these this. ladies have had these. Tell them how wonderful these are, you guys. I know. Oh, some yeah. Have I, have that. I have one. Uh-huh. Or two or three. Yeah. There might be oh, some. Yeah. Um, oh, my God. Look how pretty that is. Little. Ooh, I like that place. This is really soft. That's piece really here. pretty. There might be some appliques in there. There's this. So yeah, I just fill. I'll fill a bag. And um, like I said, this is the only one. And some bags might have a couple of the same things, but not necessarily. And the bags are ten dollars each, Michelle. No limit on this, just a list, right? Um, I guess, I guess not. I should be able to. I mean, 
unless you run out you'll go through them in order and if you run out then you'll have to just right yeah i'll put them in order but i yeah. think i i should be okay isn't okay you know. okay all right ladies here we go Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's why we asked Maggie. I knew they were good. I know, I know. Had them. These girls, right. I, some of these I girls have my cat them. frozen. I cannot see the bottom right now, but are you ready, Maggie? I'm ready. Here we go. Candy was a K boyer. One. Okay. Tiffany, shabby by design. Two. Okay. Shauna Henson, one. Okay. Lisa Jameson, one. Okay. Judy Clisby, one. Okay. Louise Frazier, one. Okay. Kathy Beige, one. Okay. Laura Taylor, one. Lori, right? Laura, Laura Taylor? Laura Taylor is yep. RC7 okay. Studios. Yep, one. Okay. okay. Natasha, two. Okay. Mousy Deb, one. Okay. Um, Candy, you're at the top. I don't know if you want to. I'll come back. You just let me know. Uh, Jennifer Jane, one. Okay. Tammy Minda, one. Okay. Deidre, one. Okay. Jamie, two. Okay. And I'm just waiting for Candy to answer me because she is on there twice. I don't know if she wants two or just one. If you could let me know, Candy. Okay, she said only one. My hand slipped. Maggie, okay. Maggie, okay. Hang up. Maggie, hold that list for a second. Okay. Um, Louise, I'm going to have you send Louise's to me because I already have a box going to her. So that way she doesn't okay. have to do double shipping. Jennifer, do you want to do the same thing? Do you want Maggie to send it to me or do you just want her to ship it to you? Because I, I mean, I can add it to your box if you want me to or she, whichever you want. Uh, Journey Stoneman, two. Okay. Yeah, Jennifer's going to have you ship it to me too and I'll just okay. add it to the box here, yeah. Okay, let me just find JJ. Okay, send to Patty. Because I do 30 or 40 pound boxes for her. That's when yep. I ship is when I fill one because it's the most economical shipping. Okay. All right, and I'm go going to do, I'll do the invoicing over the weekend and I'll get whatever, you know, I can out. Mm -hmm. um, by Wednesday, hopefully by Wednesday, I should be able to. Yeah, yeah, Jamie, we just do that for the international girls because it's just their shipping is just so ridiculous. Yeah, so we try really hard, you know, when it's the three of us to combine. You ship it to Patty. Okay, we're going to do another auction. Okay. Yay! That's another cigar box surprise. Ooh, the box is pretty look. Ooh, pretty box. Just looked up. Yeah. Mm. Okay, and yeah, this is the only right. I'm going to call this bridal bouquet box. Don't ask me why, but 
Oh, darn, I wrote Cigar Box Surprise. That's okay. <laughs> okay. okay. There's at least a yard of this. That's pretty. Isn't it pretty? Mm -hmm. And then there's the... Oh, I see my color at the bottom. She's already peeking to the bottom, you guys. You're killing me. I can see it. And then there's this one. Oh my gosh. These are all off addresses, Maggie. Then yeah. There's two of these. Look at that. Right there. <laughs> and there is a yard, a yard of this. And this is champagne. Oh. This is off. If this is the last of my very first wedding dress I ever cut up. And this was the last of the hem. See, this is one of those, it's like, oh, I wish I could see the whole dress. It had to be amazing. Oh, Patty, it was amazing. It had to be. This is the hem for Kate's sake. And it had so many appliques on it. It had like 50 appliques all over the dress. Was it like ridiculously um, heavy? It was really heavy, yes. I thought so, yeah. Can you guys even imagine what that dress looked like? It had to be like gorgeous, just gorgeous. I don't know why I have my eyes covered right now, but I knew. <laughs> <laughs> she does that all the time, you guys. All gorgeous. <laughs> Exactly, Andy Stone. Those are my words right now. Holy split. Wow. Yes, exactly. Okay. That's beautiful. This is oh, 18 wow. inches long. It's all metal. Everything's metal. See, we weren't kidding, you guys. When we told you Maggie was bringing some amazing things, we were not kidding. This one's eight. This one, I think, is a little over 18 inches. I was trying to remember when I measured it, and I didn't write it down. There's um, rhinestones and pearls. Hi, Lori. Hey, Lori. Hi, Lori. Thank you, Deidre. And then there's 18 inches of oh, this Oh, Shy's one. here, too. Hi, Shy. Hi, Shy. Uh, Maggie is selling right now, Shy. And then Patty will be selling. So there's a reason down bar. It has everything that's coming. 18 of all these. They're each 18 inches long. And then there's, this is a pin. Oh, man. Wait a minute. Nope. Sorry. It isn't. There's a loop back there. I thought it was a pin, but it's not. And then there's this piece. Oh, I need that for a barrette, for a hair piece. Exactly, Carla. That's what I do. I'm like, why am I covering my eyes? <laughs> oh, Look at that. Look at the shine on those. Exactly, Carla. So in total, there's a yard and a half of these bling pieces here. And then there's I love that. There. Oh, <laughs> okay, so this will be an auction. Outstanding. And uh, this one, I need to start it at 40, Michelle. Okay. Outstanding. I have chills. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these boxes Maggie puts together are always off the chart. Always, that always. That trim right there, the very first one you pulled out. Was this the, one here? The teardrop. Yes. That's stunning. And then the second one with the pearls. That looks like a ladder. Yeah, that right there. Oh. Oh, Jude's talking to you in chat, Max. Oh, okay. Right. I had that, I got that dress eight years, over eight years ago, Jude. 
Oh, thanks, Louise. Thanks, <laughs> Jennifer. Holy <laughs> <boy>. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I wish I had that sound effect. Remember on the TV when they used to bleep things and it'd make that noise? That would be awesome. Oh my. That's outstanding. Look at you guys go. You guys are awesome. <laughs> That's outstanding. That champagne. Oh, that's just beautiful. Mm -mm. Yeah, and if any of you guys join the group, I won't, I'm not talented enough to have the stream going and get on the laptop and go over and approve you guys right now. I'll click something wrong and something will blow up, but we'll get it approved as soon as we're done tonight and get you guys in. but for sure put pictures up. I love seeing what you guys do. I do too. It's so much fun. I'm not watching. <laughs> <laughs> I can't watch. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 nicely done. <laughs> well played, Laura Taylor. Uh, that's going to Laura Taylor, uh, okay. R7 Studios for 75. Thank Good you, Adam. Laura. Good for you, Laura. You're going to love it. Standing, Laura. Yes, ma'am. You guys are going at it, boy. I can see it now. That's why I can't watch. <laughs> um absolutely Sherilyn, yes, please. All right. Oh, oh she said fill her and give this box to Michelle. Yay. Thank you, Laura. That oh well, thank you, Laura. Oh very thank sweet. you, Laura. That's so sweet. You guys are awesome. You make me feel like I we need to step up my game. Very sweet. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, here's another another auction. One one more surprise box. Okay. <laughs> That's how I feel, Journey. I'm sitting right next to you on that bench, <laughs> literally. Oh, thank you, Laura. That's very nice. Right back at you. Okay, so we, we have some more laces. There's a yard of this. This is white. She does, Jamie. And then there's a yard of this one. Oh, Again, eyes are covered. I don't even know why. These oh, are not me. I don't all know. Really, these three are all really soft. And then over a yard of this one. And then there's this wide lace here. How pretty. And this is um, white. And then there's this beaded piece here. Oh, my. Pearls. And then we have, this is a frame, or you can use it as a frame. Oh, my gosh. What did Jennifer say? Be bleep, 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 yeah, bleep, 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 bleep. Oh, she said, holy, holy bleep. That's what Ooh, it is. <laughs> There's a smaller one. Okay. This is a pin. Oops. There she is. This has the, you can, it's so weird. You it could put a ribbon through it or anything. YouTube, but we froze. I don't freeze. That's all you, Lane. And yeah. then there's this one. There's a piece of this. 
Oh, those are. I almost went British and said, those are smashing. And then there's a piece of this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. Those that so trims different. are outstanding. I love those. Journey has a very important question. It's all in caps. Okay. Oh, yeah, I want your attention, Maggie. And poor Michelle Hartley has both elbows in a puddle of drool. <laughs> I am um, well, just different places. I find them the the bling I got at a shop that's no longer open. My laces I just find everywhere. Oh, I should leave this open. So this is going to be another auction, Michelle. You can just start this one at uh, ten, also. Yes, Jennifer. Can you create us one? I think that's a splendid idea. We want a happy cursing emoji. Yes. Like a super shocked one. Let's see what we can find. Oh, emojis have changed. There you go, Jennifer. She says, bloody brilliant they are. <laughs> <laughs> My emoji is like updated. Really? Yeah. I haven't looked at mine. I'll have to check them I have later. A I'm not even going to say which one I have. The only time I play with emojis is when I'm at Tammy's stream. Here's the curse word one. Uh-oh. Uh, that's, you can say it. I'm oh, yeah, they sure did. Oh, my. Okay. I'm going to have fun with that. Are you talking to the emojis? <laughs> I, I'm, I was there, yes, for a moment. I thought maybe you were, because I was like, wait a minute. That doesn't correlate to anything I'm seeing in the chat. Who are you talking to? Myself. <laughs> I'm listening. <laughs> I'm listening. Wow. Really? Three of us on here and there's silence? I know. That's what I was just thinking. I was like, hmm, wonder if anybody's timing us. <laughs> <laughs> First one to talk loses. Oh, thanks, Kathy. Yep, okay. Put my thumbs up. Oh, Cheryl Lynn's making guacamole. Oh, I'm coming. I'm on my way. I'm so on my way. Guacamole is my favorite. It works well. Avocados are my favorite. They work on everything. Mm -hmm. I love them on toast. Yeah. I love them on oh, booger. The only time I've ever liked avocados is in sushi. Isn't yeah. that weird? I no. love sushi. Mm. Oh my gosh, Jamie, you still have them? Oh, poor thing. Oh, she's got hives? Oh, yeah, she no. had one Monday, and she thought chopping oh. would help, but it didn't help. Oh. oh. Stop stressing, girl. Take a bubble bath. Yeah. The only time I get the hives is when I'm panicked about one of the kids. That is sold to Judy Clispy. $30. Well done, Judy. Nice, Thank Judy. You. I think that's the first thing, time I've ever said her last name properly. <laughs> I always call her crispy. Uh, yeah, it's crispy. I hope I'm saying it right. <laughs> Look how excited she is. We. Mm -hmm. Hi, Kathy. That's a good idea, too. Take an oatmeal bath. Yes, Jamie. Oh, my goodness. Poor dear. Okay, so I have one more thing, and then I do have. 
anybody's interested, they can let me know um, a couple of handmade items. But if they're not, that's that's okay too. Um, I have some their their fabric and paper flowers, like I am roses, wild orchid craft. Then there's some fabric ones. I call them fabric because it's like some have um, satin in that. And I made. I only have one of each, but I have a white and a peach. It's coming off orange, but it's it's peach, JJ. And then I have pink. <gasps> and I have blue. The blue, and then I have, and I also have purple. Um, and I didn't have enough to fill the bag, so I added some white flowers to uh, these two. So there's blue, white. purple, pink, peach, and white. Peach. And just there's just one of each. Blue, purple, missing one color. Pink. Pink. No, I have to make five all together, right? White, right. Peach, blue, purple, pink. Peach, blue, purple, pink, and white. Yeah, okay, what I said, Meg. <laughs> yeah. This, this five. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> and um, these are these are just going to be $5 each, but I only have one of each. Okay. So with this one, ladies, uh, what I will do, I will take the first white, I will take the first peach, I will take the first blue, I will take the first purple, I will take the first pink. Meg, is there a limit on these bags, or it's a uh, free-for-all, go for it. Um, let's do, let's just do one, you know, one to each for this one where I only have one of each color. Okay. So everybody get your me. Well, you don't even have to get your me ready. Just get your color ready. White, peach, blue, purple, pink. That's what I'll be looking for. I will take the first one that I see of each color. I am talking for a very long time so you guys can get it loaded up. Or do like okay. adding and put any. Just put any. Then you just don't care. Any just makes me no. <laughs> <laughs> then I gotta pick your stuff. Do uh, it. Just do all right, it. Here we go. Hi, Crystal. Hey, Hi, Crystal. Hi, Crystal. Hi. Okay, those are gone. Gone, 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 gone. So I'm ready I'm whenever ready. you are. You ready? Yep. Natasha Blue. Okay. Tiffany Shabby by Design. Pink. Not just pink, but pink. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you could, Maggie, pull those colors off while I do this so I can use the screen as a reference, please. Take the blue, take the pink. Oh, oh, sorry. Okay. So take the, the blue and the pink. Yeah. And the blue. So you okay. have three left, right? Right. Oh, purple. Okay. All right. Next one is Sandy Garrett. Special request. Please bill her, but she wants it sent to Laurel. Oh. Gee, I wonder which one that one is. Yes, purple. Okay, Sandy. To Laurel. Send purple. to Laurel. That's awesome, Sandy. She is going yep, to that's love that. That's very sweet, Sandy. She is going to love nice. it. Okay. Oh, and she's not here, so it'll be a surprise. Jennifer Jane will take the peach. And Paula Fowler is getting that white one. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Sold. Nice. Job. All right, now they can let me know if they're interested in seeing anything handmade. Sandy's Maybe I don't know you like purple. I don't know. I didn't know that. I'm going to have to start a list of these girls and their colors. Well, welcome back, Crystal. We're glad you came back. Mm 
Oh, nice tip, Jamie. Thank you. So anybody that wants to learn about avocado dyeing, Jamie gave us a tip there. What? How do you say it? Is it one, one bar? Shy, I did see yours, but you were after Paula. David. <laughs> <laughs> I think they call that jaundice, David. Just kidding. Okay. All right. So I guess. Handmade I, items, ladies. I just wrote it in. Yes or no? My bad. I should have wrote that in. Sorry. It didn't post as a link, but they got the. Um, but they got her name. Yeah, that's Denise Wonderbar. Yeah, I like her. Um, Megan, it's good. It's going to be yes. Okay. All right. And these will just, these will be auctions, Michelle. Okay. All right. So the first one is a um, wall hanging. And I don't know if you can see, but this is like a seafoam green color here. And there's dangles, I, there's pearls to hang it. Oh, that's pretty. This has a lot of Crafty Me shop on here. Um, Melanie would like to know if you can back out your camera just a tad so oh, they can uh, I can try. It's on like one of these wiggle things, but let me see. How's that? I can actually, I can like hold it up a little. Let me turn it sideways for a sec. Yeah. Okay, what do you want to start this at? Um, you could start it at 10. Good luck, ladies. Thanks, Jamie. Mm -hmm. I have one of her fabric, or er, yeah, one of her books. Oh, have, thanks, yeah. Paula and Natasha. That's what I was going to say. I have two. Mm -hmm. And Very they detailed. are beautiful. Very detailed. Yeah, they are. <laughs> I should show on the back. I was just going to ask you if we wanted. Yeah, to this was a, this was a, these were doilies. There's a fabric doily, and then there's this this doily here is the base of it, and then I put some batting behind the image. I just love that image. Maggie, if we wanted to use this for a cover, we could adhere it to a cover, right? Oh yeah, you could. This yeah, you would just have to. This is um, hot glue, so you just mm -hmm. run the thing to take it off if you wanted to. But oh yeah, you can do whatever you want with it. And then, as I said, this piece that goes around here is sea foam green, and then you have there's gold threading in these. And then there's the dangles. There's one, two, three, four rows of dangles. The flower appliques. Right, Tammy? Nice touch. I think I may have put one too many periods on that second there. <laughs> I'm just saying. Did you forget to pick your finger up there, Scott? My word. That is sold to Jennifer Jane for $20. Okay. okay. Thank you, JJ. Done, Jennifer.
right, Minka? <laughs> Beautiful, Megs. Thank you. Well done. Okay, the next thing I have is it looks like a book, but it's Ooh, actually, oh, it's actually made with um, shirt. with little bags, little gift okay. bags, and they all they have um, cameos. This is the side. Look at your spine. And then there's there's just tons of dangles. These flowers I made out of trims. There's pearls, rhinestones, my clay flowers. And each each page has a like I said, and you can, you know, you could put a tag in there or whatever. So that's the front cover. And then this is the back. Make this is a wide it. embroidered, whoops, yeah, there you go. wide embroidered trim here. And then there's just, I think, I want to say there's three or four rows on each page of the, of the dangles you can see down the bottom. And then you open it up. Ooh. Okay. Each page has, I think, except for, the, I think I made a flower page and that there isn't a cameo on that, but each page has a cameo. There's appliques with my little clay flowers. And then this one's a cameo and it's got some doilies behind it the little flowers I make with the trims and more dangles. There's you rhinestones. You look at it and you see something different every time. Oh, and my. there's this one. This is a trim too here. Little pieces of applique. And then there's this here, this piece. This could be like a necklace. Rhinestones, clay flowers again. Different um, trims in the background. More dangles. And then this is a flower page. Little clay flowers. This is a rose applique. And then this is the last page. Oh, that girl's pretty in that cameo. Isn't she? I think I think there's a I forget. I got the I got this from an a little Etsy shop. And I think this is one of the images that you can find, you know, on Pinterest. Mm -hmm. And she just, she must have shrunk them and then put them in the, um, you know, the cameo piece. That's beautiful. And then little clay flowers. Again, I don't know if you can really see them. So wow. there's, each page has, like I said, has, they're all the bags. That's really different. I've never seen anything with a side pocket like that. Uh -uh, me either. Kind of new for you. Yeah, I made this a while ago. That's I just, nice. I had these little bags and I had, you know, altered some of them as little gift bags. And I was trying to think of what I could do for something different. So I just made it into a book. Um, Maggie, Kathy Beige wants to know if you make your clay flowers. And hello, Renee. Hi, Renee. I don't. No, I don't, you can see how I could never make something that tiny anyways, but <laughs> I mean, those are really tiny. That's, this is, whoa. And you can see the little pearls all over the trim there. So that's going to be auction. Well, we started that, Max. 
Um, this one, could you start at 20? $9 million. No doubt. Wow. Holy crap. Whew. Go, Fowler. Oh, thanks, wow. Jen. That's just unique. I like that. I think it would be a really sweet keepsake for like a bride. You know, for the something old, something new, something borrowed, mm -hmm. something blue. She'd have a different page to or a different pocket to tuck each thing in. I think that could be really sweet. Again, three of us, and it's silent. Come on, I'm the one. <laughs> but I'm thinking, I'm like, is there anybody I could possibly use this? <laughs> I'm like, hmm. I'm watching the clock. I have an excuse. You two speak. I just think it's gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. I, I have right. no words. All my words are I gone. know. You could put like a hanky in one of them. Yeah. Something blue in another. Well, actually, there's something blue. That's right. Blue. Yeah. Um, you could put a piece of jewelry in another, you know, like a necklace yeah. or, mm -hmm. or a bracelet. I was just trying to find something different to. It's well, hard sometimes to find different things to make, you know. I think you nailed it. I just just say it. Yeah, you did. I've not seen, like I said, I've never seen you make anything like that. That's, that's really, that's really cool. Oh, geez, I gotta get my. Oh yeah, oh yeah, typing. Who's yeah. I'm just, I'm just staring at it. Mm -hmm. I see, like fifty million things. I love it. Yeah, and this cameo, I think. You know, the one that you said the image was really pretty. Mm -hmm. I think I got there were three different ones, and this was another one. I had used the other on something different. Calm there and down there, Judy. <laughs> and luckily, a second one came in after my stop. <laughs> she was outbidding herself. Um, that is sold to Judy Crispy. Okay. For 43. Thank you, Yay. Judy. Well done, Judy. Well done. That's beautiful. Hey, you got a Maggie book. You got it. It's all yours. That's beautiful. Don't be sorry, Jeepers. Mm -hmm. Elbows out. Go for it. Okay. That was cool, Mags. Thank you. I now like I that. have it's a it's just a little um lace and, and paper. It's a little fabric and paper book. And I think I, I did measure it and I want to say it's like five and a half. What I do with my ruler. Oh, here's one. Oh, that's cute. I just looked up. Oh, yeah. and it's got bears on the Yeah, block. six and a half by five. And then the images of paper. Here's a little paper butterfly. Ooh. And then there's um, the base of the book was Michelle. I got this from these from you. Remember? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I made some little what I had left over. I made into um, little small uh, lace books. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was the base. Here, I'll open it up. This is the front and the back. Hey, Maggie, I'm going to interrupt you for one second. Sure. Judy, got, Judy got that last one to give to her granddaughter-in-law for her wedding in April. Oh, nice. Oh, pictures. Oh, nice, Judy. That's going to be great. So, again, there's clay flowers. Here's a... Um, acrylic flower with a little rhinestone in it. There's appliques, 
there's flower um, trim. And again, there's, there's, um, there's like two or three. I did this one a little different. They're not really dangles at the bottom. I just did the same. I used the same trims all around. So that's the front and the back. And then you open it up. Butterfly. Here's a pocket page. And I just put a few little like tags in there because it's paper too. And I made the um the pocket out of a half of one of these. I had a, a couple left. So I cut them in half so I could make a pocket with them. And I use little appliques. Here's a I used this trim. I had it in sage green and then this is pink and then i also have it in blue hey laurel page. hi laurel hey laurel and then this page here this is paper there's a there's a doily behind that there's little flower appliques there's rhinestones oh my God. there's different little trims This is the one in blue. I wanted to bring oh. out the blue. And then here's a, another little butterfly. Here's some applique. Here's one that's in that flower, um, fabric flower bag. Here's a little paper heart. I made this, this here is made out of the, some of the flower appliques that are in that bag also. I just use different ones and put them on top of each other. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Michelle just had a small earthquake over there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then here's a flower page. All we can see is her eyeballs, you guys. <laughs> yep. Totally up in her camera. <laughs> Okay, so this is a flower page. And then the last page is this paper here. And here's another little um, paper butterfly. And there's appliques and rhinest little rhinestone pieces. It's just a little, a little book. That's a pretty one, Maggie. Thank you. Even with Miss Comedian over there. <laughs> Standing. Okay, so this is an auction. Gotcha. Let's just start this at 10. You got it. I just think it's cool how... You can tell by looking at them that they're yours, but they all are so different. Well, thank you, Patty. That's You're a welcome. compliment to know that, you know, somebody looks at something and says, oh, that's Maggie's or, you know, oh, that's Michelle's. You can just always tell when it's your work. Oh, yeah. I always thought I had a, you know, fairly decent... What do I want to say? Like I was able to layer and tell, like I started really watching what you do and I'm like, um, you better just sit back and take notes. And yeah. And then you get it in your hand and you look at it and you're like, I'm not even on yeah. that level. <laughs> not even. <laughs> to think, to put those things in the dangles and the clay flowers and just the, the detail is like I said, I open it every time and go, oh, didn't see that before. Didn't see that before. Always something. Stunning, Megs. Thank you. <clears throat> Again, can you two have a conversation, please? <laughs> I'm watching the show. I never. I just don't know what to say. 
It's intimidating putting your work out there. It, it is. is. Isn't it? You're doing all right. I love it. Maggie, yeah. if my work looked like yours, I would not be intimidated, I don't think. I mean, I get it, but I'm just saying, I, I don't know. It's a lot of you ladies that post pictures and we see them and I'm just like, wow, this is cool that goes behind it. <laughs> Look who just got her second Maggie book. Uh-oh. That's going to Judy Crispy for $40. Oh, thank you, Judy. Good job, Judy. Well done. Nice job. <laughs> Oh, and I just want to say, Laurel got her butt kicked at bowling tonight. Yep, she did. She did. Cam kicked the butts. Is that because Cam is more better? Yeah, more better than you. <laughs> <laughs> right now, she's rolling her eyes going, I hate them all. <laughs> Yes, seriously, seriously. Seriously, it's because she's more better. Well, that's it for me, ladies. Oh, my gosh. When she gets done, she's just like, okay, I'm done now. <laughs> wow, man. Well, all right. <laughs> okay. Well, let me hey, see if you work, stay on here and work on some snippet bags. <laughs> <laughs> you get the work in there, woman. All right, wave goodbye to him, Mags, and then I'm going to flip the camera over. Okay. Thanks, everyone. Thank you all. Okay. See, it's kind of like I left it. I did scooch it all out of the way. Or I would have had my elbows in it. She did great, didn't she, you guys? She did. I told you. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. That was fantastic. Thank you. Yep, yep. She brought amazing stuff, didn't she? Man. So... I know some of you ladies like hankies and I found these in the boxes. So I decided to leave them there. You can um, talk for a minute Lane, cause I need a Westward ho. Absolutely. All right. Okay. My mouth is tired. Okay. Hold on. Okay. So while she's gone, you guys can look <laughs> at the hankies. Um, I want to know if you guys want them flat priced or if you want, to auction them. If we auction them, it's going to be all three of them together. So you get all three. We're not going to split them up. You get all three if we of the hankies if we auction them. So I just need to know if you guys want me to flat price them individually or if you want to auction them as a lot. Um, but while she's gone, if you weren't here when we started, I was asking, and now that Lori's here and Sean is here and Laura Taylor, some of you might be able to help me. I, I'm discovering the more I look at lace, the less I know about lace. Hey, Evadine. Um, does anybody know, like, what kind of lace this is? Like, if I wanted to go in, like, a shop and ask for this lace, what what do you ask for? What What is it? Is it a style? Is it a technique? Because I, I just don't know. <laughs> Did you I just see Judy? Yeah, I understand, Judy. So, so there's that. And then, I mean, I knew about bobbin lace. I kind of thought I knew what bobbin lace was, but then I started really looking at it and learning about it and in doing a little, you know, research. And I've come to the realization that bobbin lace is like paper. There's as many different styles, I guess, as there is types of paper. So like, this is a bobbin lace. Let me get it on my hand there. That's a bobbin lace. You know, at first glance, it kind of looks crocheted, but it's not. It's a bobbin lace. This one is, and this one's a handmade bobbin lace. This one is a machine made. And then there's, there's this one. And, oops, wrong side. Nope, this is the right side. 
and I don't know, like this one, I, I would love to say that I know that it's handmade, but I don't know that it's handmade. That's beautiful. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, I, but I also understand now why these hold up so well because they look so dainty and fragile, but they're really not. They're actually really, really sturdy. So Esme. what? I said, hi, Esme. Oh, hey, Esme. Hi, Esme. Ooh, maybe she has some answers. She's the lace lady. So, you know, like I was saying, there's just, there's so many different types. And this one, I mean, this one is obviously a machine made. And then there's these little flaps that are embroidered. And like this, there's two of these. I don't even know what this is. What would you use this for? Because it's a finished piece because it's scalloped all around all four edges. Like, see the scalloping, the scalloped edge? I should have pressed this and I just didn't. Um, see the scalloped edge? And I guess it goes around three sides. So it goes around, was this a cuff? I mean, I just, I don't know. My first thought was, was it a cuff? You think this one's handmade, Esme? Melanie. <laughs> Peekaboo Pacey? Very well, could wait, this one. I bet she meant this one. You think this one's handmade? See, I just, I just don't know what to, I just don't know for sure what to look for to know if they're handmade or machine made. Yes, that one. Okay, so I'm going to take her word for it because this is what Esme does, you guys. Esme does lace. Um, and then there's this one. And this one, I'm pretty confident saying that this one is handmade. But again, it's still bobbin lace. And bobbin lace is more of a woven technique without a loom. They're actually just twisting. I guess that's what you call it. They're twisting and almost braiding sometimes the threads and they kind of move them across but you'll see like in here where it looks let me see if i can get it this looks woven but it's not it's just what they call and i keep wanting to say stitches but they're not stitches yeah it's pretty right esme it's so pretty mm -hmm. i found um some lace makers that are doing videos and it's, I could sit and watch them for hours. It's just beautiful. It's fascinating it, to watch. Yeah, it is. It really is because their hands are just flying and these, and you can just see the threads moving. And the one lady really took the time to explain that like, they'll have this whole, like here, here, here's, here's the edge of the lace. And then there's all these, threads coming down and then there's these wooden bobbins that almost look like the old peg clothes pins. Some are real fancy, some are, are more plain, but they might have 25 threads across here, but the ones on the edges will move all the way across and then they get over here and they will loop it or twist it and then they bring those same ones all the way back. So it really is a weaving process because you're kind of moving those, those threads back and forth and then that ends my knowledge. Because then I just get hung up in watching them. Yeah, it is. It is crazy to watch them, isn't it? Yeah, I love it. So um, I have these and then I have a whole. OK, Esme, while you're here, I have this whole piece of this that I found. And this is cotton. But there's 10 yards of this. Would they have made, handmade a 10 yard piece of this? Because I always feel like when I find a crazy long piece, like did somebody really sit and make a 10 yard piece of this? Or a 10 yard length of it? I guess a 10 yards isn't a piece. She said yes. See, that's just crazy to me. The hours that would have gone into this. And this one I can tell is handmade because there's just slight imperfections in it. Um, only like a spacing imperfection. Do you know what I mean? Like the spaces in between some of these aren't perfect like a machine would have done. So that's the only reason I'm leaning toward handmade on this one. Yeah. See, you probably can see right away, 
but I don't always know. I mean, if it's crocheted, I can I can tell right away if it's handmade or machine made. But like this this bobbin lace, I mean, I just feel like I know enough to be dangerous. I know what it is, but I don't. I'm not educated on it at all. So, but yeah, there's this whole ten yard piece, ten yard bundle, <laughs> and it's beautiful. It, it really is beautiful. Is beautiful. Um, and then there's this piece, and this one, you know, and here again, it's bob. But look how different they all are, and they're all considered bobbin lace. And this one is obviously machine made. See there. That's really pretty too. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love that one. But it's and it's obvious. Yeah, see, machine. Yeah, see, and I could tell that right away because it doesn't. It feels like it's a poly blend. You know, like it's a little bit cotton and poly. Um, but that's what I go by if I'm not sure. It's when I know that it's cotton that I'm not a hundred percent sure. Then I start second guessing myself. Um, but yeah, I just. So don't be surprised if we have more lace conversations, you guys, because as I learn, I'm going to keep bringing it and I'm going to keep asking you guys because I feel like you're all very educated and we all know different things. So I'm going to use the resources available to me. Um, so there's that little fun fact. Um, so now that Michelle's back, I'll move the laces. Um, and I asked you the question and I'm sorry, I totally went down the rabbit trail of the lace and didn't pay attention to the answers. Um, <laughs> so do you guys want, so back to the original question, are we going to do these? Do you want me to flat price the boxes of hankies, you know, so we can do them by the each, or do you guys want to auction them as a lot for the all three? I know I'm, I know I goofed up. I asked you guys the questions and I walked I went back up. It's all flat. It's all flat. Okay, never mind. Michelle's got it. Okay, so these are going to be, let's do them $10 a box. ABC? Um, let's do, this is, at, let me hold them up so you can see them. This one's pink. We're going to go by color. We'll call this one pink because it's in a pink box. Oop, there it is. See the pink in the background? So we'll call this one pink. And that is, that's embroidered. And there's three of them in there. Or wait, is it? hold on, hold on. This might just be one giant one. No, it's three. There's three. So there's three in that one. We're going to call this one the blue one. And then we'll call this one, call this one gold because it's in a gold box and it's got the gold label. And these are embroidered also. And there's only two in this one. So blue, pink, gold. All right. Again, I'm just going to look for the first pink, the first blue, the first gold. So get it loaded. I will take a moment before I put it in and oh. I forgot to type go. So I guess so, Jude. Holy cow. I'm jealous. No, I'm not jealous. I don't like jealous. I'm envious. I'm envious. Oh, oh my gosh. That came in right in order. Sold. Cool. Esme, Esme Pink. Hi, Evadine. Esme Pink. Evadine Blue. Mary Gold. Awesome. Thanks, ladies. That was perfect. Yeah, it was. Mary, I forgot to ask you, how'd you do with your sale? Did you survive? <laughs> you did a great job, by the way. Yep, I was really there all day, Mary. Cheering you on. Left your message on Facebook. You did good. Um, okay, so, and I'm going to let you guys kind of be the boss of this tonight. Um do you want these pieces? How do you guys want to do this? You want to do this as one, all the bobbin lace as a lot. Do you want to do separate pieces? How do, how do you want to, how do you, how do you, how do you, what do you guys think? Cause I'm kind of okay. Any way you guys want to go, you tell me. 
This one's not bobbin lace, so I'm not going to put that one in here. This is bobbin lace, though. And this one I know is embroidered. Whoop, there we go. This is embroidered, and then this is the bobbin lace here on the trim edge. Oh, nice. I will take all the education you can share, Jude. I mean, like literally, no joke. Paula said one lot. That's all we got so far. And Jennifer says three small lots. Uh-oh, puppies escaped. Go get them, Candy. Go get them. Yeah, see, that's where I was. It's like, okay, um, we can do that. I'll do three. I'll do three. And then you guys can pick. You know what? I'll do. I'll split it with you. I'll do two. I'll do two. So we'll put this one. This one's really nice. So this one will get the machine-made piece. Then I know we're all after this one because this one's really pretty. And we'll put these two with this one. And there's this piece. And this is, um, I didn't measure this, but I'm going to say you've got between a yard and a half and two yards of this. So we'll put that there. Then we'll put the pretty embroidered piece over here. And then we'll put this this is let me measure this one quick let's see this one is 32 so this one's just short of a yard and we'll put this one here and then this smaller piece here so yep yeah, we'll do a or b so there we go. Um, and we're probably going to do several auctions tonight, you guys. And just like I said, I just want it to be just, just fun and easy. So we'll just do an A and a B on this, Michelle. And if you'll just start it for a dollar. Those are all so pretty and different. Aren't they? I love them. They're all different. You know, and I really thought I knew quite a bit about lace until I started really starting to dig into this. And I'm like, oh, good grief. It's mm -hmm. insane. I thought I did too. I know nothing. I, I came to that conclusion real quick. I know nothing. So it's my new project. So you guys will hear me babbling about it a lot until you get tired babble of me. Away, babble away. <laughs> <laughs> They'll let me know when they're over it. Okay, can we go back to the paper, please? <laughs> oh, and I have tatting, you guys. I we're gonna do a tatting lot too. Oh yeah, she does. Right. This one piece is amazing. Laurel, get your whatchamajigger ready, your screenshot thing of a dingy ready. I'll hold it up for you so you can see it. Laurel does tatting, you guys, and she's like, she's gotten good enough at it that she can figure out the pattern on her own, which I think is super cool. Right. It's amazing. I just got some. Oh, I know, right? Mm -hmm. I can't even follow a pattern. You know, I can follow a crochet pattern all day, every day. You hand me knitting needles, and I might as well shove them in my eyes. <laughs> so you're right? much Oh my God! Don't do that. I have. I don't understand people who knit. I just. I don't understand. I get so frustrated. 
I'm just like, mm -mm, I'm done now. They just turn into weapons for me. No, I am. I'm never going to be a knitter. Never. Zero patience for it. Yeah, crispy it is. And you know it's perfect because it's Laurel. She oh my gosh, we were in that one night. I can't even tell you how long she sat there and picked out her, I don't know, knots, twists, whatever they call them. It was a little crazy. It really was a little bit crazy. Hey, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. That is sold to Karen Thompson, 35. Would you like A or B? That she was like A. Awesome. Second in line would be Paul Fowler. Would you like B? For how much, Michelle? 35. Okay. Thanks, Karen. Paul oh my gosh. gosh. Uh, the next one I see would be Esme. Would you like B for 35? On. Thanks, Gary. Um, let's see here. There we go. It's like I lost my basket. Oh, your dad used to carve slingshots. That's cool. Super cool. <laughs> so I'm going to put B on here. If anybody's interested in this, just shoot me an email. It's still available. Yeah. And I did that that way on, on purpose, you guys. I put all the delicate ones together because I figured that's the ones you guys were probably after. So that's why I did all the delicate ones in the one and then the heavier ones on the other side. So um, let's do the tatting and get that out of my system. So here's a doily. That again, I should have pressed and totally didn't. But look at that. Pretty. Yep. And Laurel, I don't know if you can see mm. enough of that one or not. But you, you do enough doilies. You probably, this other trim here is the one I wanted you to see anyway. So, but there's the doily. And it is, let's mm. say, if it was pressed, it's going to be like two and three quarter inches wide. If, if it was all pressed out. Okay. So there's that. Then there's this piece, which is like a bone white. So there's that one. She said up close, please. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you want that one, absolutely. Um, so there's that piece. This piece measures, let's see here, um, 18 inches. So we've got 18 on that one. Let me get Laurel her up close shot of this. I probably stuck my finger right in it. I just like the spidery threads in the center. I think that's different. Okay, so there's that one. And then this piece is a slightly, Laurel, what do they call these? These The circle, what is that called? I know it has a name, but I don't know what it's called. And this is like um, a nice vintage ivory color. It's not cream, it's not really tan, but it's a nice vintagey. So I'm going to measure this loose because these always have a little stretch in them. So there's one yard. There's two. So this is two yards and 12 inches on this one. We got two yards, nice. 12 inches. Yeah. And this, this, all of this tatting is handmade. And then there's this one. This is the one Laurel right here. Look at that, you guys. Ooh. Oh, wow. 
Isn't that the prettiest? Mm -hmm. I've never seen one like this. I just think this is so ridiculously pretty. And do you know what I've learned too by digging into this? They didn't treasure tatting as much as they did the handmade bobbin lace. Um, tatting was really, when they started making it, Picos, yeah. When they started making the bobbin lace, it was for undergarments and children's clothes. And bobbin lace was for adult women's clothing. I just think that's interesting because we all go nuts over the tatting and they didn't consider it fancy. So this piece is 26 inches and it's, let's see here, an inch and a half wide on this one. I just, I love this piece. I That's just, beautiful. Isn't it pretty? <clears throat> I just love that one. So we're going to do these four pieces together as an auction. And then just as a little teaser, this, this tablecloth is coming and look at the tatting on this all around the room. And this cut work was all hand done. And you can tell when you look at the wrong side because you can see a little bit of the raw edge and I'll just the cut threads and a little bit of the unevenness. But this and the hemline, the hemline. Wait, let me find the camera. There we go. The hem really gives it away. I mean, it's neatly done, but you can tell that it's handmade and not machine done. That's gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? It is. Yeah, so pretty. And the time that went into this is insane. You ready to start this now? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Because the tablecloth is separate. I was just showing them that. I thought I was wasting the clock time while I was showing them. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. We're new, you guys. We're, we don't have a, you know, we're new. We're figuring it out. It's amazing. It is amazing, right? Really pretty. And fun to work with. I'm looking at my even, right now, so. Yeah, I can't even imagine the time and the patience to make this. And they just didn't even consider it fancy. That's just crazy. Yeah, I think so. Like I said, the doily should have been pressed. I just didn't get to it. If I could just figure out how to get six more hours in a day. <laughs> just imagine how much more one could get done with six more hours in a day. Way too noisy over there. Hey, watch a network. <laughs> oh, I want to do build a bundles too, you guys. You guys want to do build a bundles? Fun. Haven't seen those I, in a while. I like build a bundles. I was thinking <clears throat> build a bundles. With doilies crocheted stuff you know the stuff we all know what it is the crocheted stuff i'll have to go grab another basket i didn't bring i thought i had them all here but i didn't and i've got fabric packs if you guys want to look at fabric packs yep build a bundles they're fun stuff i think Who doesn't love a good bab? A bab. Right. I'm looking, 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 looking. Oh, and gloves. We have gloves. Shut up. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, my. It all came at the same time. Hold on. <clears throat> Uh, the first one I see is Paula Fowler, 23. Awesome. Thanks, Paula. 
Yeah, nice Paula. Paula loves her some tatting. Okay, so this piece, let's do this one. And I'm just going to flat price this one. So let's just do this piece. It is, let's see here, 27 inches, 27 inches of that. So pretty. I think so. Let's just do this one for $4. I would get that up. <laughs> what? She's the Michelle. I really wish you'd quit killing the birds. <laughs> <laughs> it's just my timer thing. <clears throat> Not as sold. It's a Melanie. To Melanie, you said? Mm hmm Okay. Thanks, Melanie. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, let's see here. Um, this one I showed you, sort of. So, let's do this one. That's a... Kind of tablecloth. It is a tablecloth. It's um, I think it's square. Hang tight. Let me measure. Including the including the tatted edges, it is thirty two inches by. Let's see here. Ladder auction sixteen thirty two. So it's thirty two by thirty two, and the only flaw that I have seen in it is there's one spot right there. Can you guys, yep, you can see it right there. Just barely. Yeah, just barely. But it's it's like like there was a drop of coffee or a drop of tea right there. Um, but like I said, you can, from the backside, you can see the hemline and the stitching. So they mm -hmm. cut all of this and then did all the stitching around the raw edges from the right side. Oh, and see? I missed this when I was looking at it earlier. There's this thread has come disconnected right here, but this could be retacked. And then there's one right here that needs to be retacked back over. Because these are actually knotted usually. So they could, you could tack that right back on there. So it's got the same embroidery in all four corners. Let me see if I can pull them in so you can see all four corners. And it's my acro color. Yep. So mm. all four corners. And then this is your tatting design that goes all the way around. Hang on. It goes all the way around. That's beautiful. So if you wanted to take this, I mean, if you wanted to use this and take this tatting off, you'd have 32 inches four times. So you'd have like three and a half yards of this tatting if you wanted it. So I'm going to flat price this one. And I'm going to say, let's do this for, um, let's just do it for 40. That way you guys won't go nuts. Keep you all under control. It's sold to Melanie. Awesome, thanks Melanie. So there's that one. Then we have, I'm a tiny bit all over. Can you guys tell? Let's do Natasha's gloves so I don't forget these. You guys remember she sent me some stuff and we looked at all of those last week. And I saved the gloves for tonight. Um, so these, this pair... You go back to that tatted tablecloth and it's sold to Judy Crispy, Melanie Retract. Okay. Thanks, Judy. <laughs> no, no worries, Melanie. It's okay. 
Yeah, don't ever don't apologize for that stuff, you guys. It happens. Right now, Judy's doing cartwheels, so it's all good. <laughs> <laughs> so these are leather, these are leather, these are leather. These are these are a suede. I'm gonna put these in the suede. These are leather. Those are a knit. Okay, so there's these four. Let me turn them the right way for you guys. How about that? And I promise you, with my giant hands, there's no way I could even begin to try to model them for you. So, nope, my fingers aren't going in there either. Um, they are always stretchier than you think they're going to be, but I have yet to find a pair of vintage ladies' gloves that would fit me. They are. Yep. These are all vintage. Yes, ma'am. Um, these I would say are probably just by the style of them and the way they're marked on the inside. I think these are like, you know, like the Kennedy era. Does that make sense? Um, is, is the, is what I'm thinking by the stitching that's on the, there we go, along the hem and the kind of leather that they are. And these are all so very soft and supple, you guys. They're just, they're awesome. And this one has, you know, the stitching on the back to help with the fit. Here's the back side of these with that stitching across the back of the hand again. And these are a little bit longer, this pair here. And we're gonna ABCD them this pair is like 11, 11 and a half inches long. So we'll A, B, C, D them, okay? So A is, I should probably turn the ruler the right way, like eight and a half inches from the longest fingertip to the, to the cuff or the hem is nine and a half. And this pair is eight inches. So um, I just think they're pretty. I wish I had small enough hands because I would wear these. I think they're cute. I think they're fun, but I totally would. But like I said, with my giant hands, I'm never going to never find ladies leather gloves that fit. Vintage ones anyways. Yeah, at least not vintage ones. I really want a pair too, but it's never... Not yet. Not yet. Hang tight. There we go. There's D. So these are going to be, let me see. I have it written down. Hold on. So we're going to flat price these. These, we're going to do them $6 a pair. So we've got A, B, C, or D, and then there's the other three. And these four are leather. Super nice leather, actually. I will take the first A, B, C, or D that I see. Capiche? All right, here we go. Oh my God, Jennifer Jane, I don't know how you did that, girl. <laughs> Seriously, that was really great. Mary, I love the choices, thank you. <clears throat> Okay, Jennifer Jane is going to take B. Okay. We're going to have to go with Mary's second choice, which was C. Okay. And A and D are still available. Okay. So I'm going to put these on here. If anybody's interested in these later, just give me a shout. Ooh, they'll be here. Okay, so we'll put those up there. These two go down here. Esme will take D. Okay. Thanks, Esme. Thanks, ladies. So A is still available. Yep. Awesome. Okay. Awesome, awesome. So then... 
there's these and these are like i don't know that they're just like a poly but look they're a, it's this is i never know what this fabric is it's interesting though it's very strange those are sold mary will take a oh okay awesome thank you mary Evadine says they're suede or heavy felt. That's what it is right there. That one. Cause it's not suede. Thank you, Evadine. Um, but look at the embroidery. Do you guys so pretty? Isn't that pretty right up there? Along that thumb? Yeah. It's so incredibly, there it is. So incredibly feminine. Yeah. That's pretty. I love these. So there's this pair and these do have a little bit of, um, I don't want to call it staining, but a little bit of spotting. I feel like with some, maybe some OxyClean or something, you could brighten these up for sure. I think they're really, really pretty and sweet. These are like, these are suede. This pair is suede. Um, I don't think these are as old, but these, they're so incredibly soft, you guys. Like so incredibly soft. I can't even begin. I'm sitting here trying to think what can I compare them to. Are they gray, Paula? They Is are gray. Yes, they're gray. And Paula, I'm willing to bet these would fit you. They're so tiny. The fingers are just so tiny. Um, Paula's only three foot tall, you guys. So she's got like <laughs> the smallest hands on the planet. Oh my gosh. These <laughs> and she only weighs like 50 pounds. Yeah, well, three foot. She gets people. smaller every time, just like me. <laughs> These are eight and a half inches from the finger, the longest fingertip to like what would be right here is eight and a half inches. Um, but they're just they're so so nice. And then they've got that that stitching, you know, to help with that fit across the back of the hand and allow some give in there. Those are really nice. And then, you, then these are considered opera gloves. Yes, you guys, the mm -hmm. long ones, is that what they call them was opera yes. gloves? Yeah. And they've got the little bit of elastic stitching right here at the wrist. Oh, these, yeah. yeah, these are yeah. almost pristine too. And they're again, incredibly soft and so well done. Look at that stitch that goes all the way up from the outside or for, well, the back side on the back side. They're just, they're so, I like so those. yep. Yeah. These are really, really nice. So these we will do for, well, let me label them. These are going to be $4 a pair and we'll, I'll get these labeled up for you guys. So we have a, Be oh, five foot tall. She is <laughs> right. not five three. She's fibbing. She's three foot tall. Michelle is three foot one inches tall. <laughs> Maggie's not any taller than either one of them. <laughs> Just saying. Okay, so A, B, or C. Oops, she almost can't even see the opera gloves. There they are. There we go. This may have said I'm a monster then. <laughs> when, oh, I'm five nine. Yes, Esme. Yes, I feel you. I'm five nine. They make me feel like ginormous. Those are definitely sold. Okay. Tiffany, Tiffany Shabby by design will take B and C. Hang on one second. Tiffany. Tiffany, it's C, right? Tiffany, your first first initial of your last name is a C. I think. Okay. And A? Mary Seaver. Okay. Really, Esme, I would have never thought you were that tall. Yes. It's, yes. Uh, I'm finally not the tallest person. Yippee. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Awesome. Awesome. So I got to know, what size shoe do you wear, Esme? I got to know. If you got to struggle as hard for shoes as I do, 
Shopping for shoes is one of the most painful things for me, you guys. I need a size 11. Oh, my daughter-in-law's an 11. She it's has the same problem. It's horrible. Exactly. Patty and a bunch of Tinker Bells. Exactly. <laughs> Evadeen wears a 12. Wow. See, now, you know, I will say I was incredibly excited when I saw them start making women's shoes in a 12 because if they're not wide enough, you need that length. 10 or 2. See, cheater. Jeez. Judy wears a 10 or 11. It is terrible, right? It's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. And the, the absolute worst is trying to find women's tennis shoes in an 11 when you have a super wide foot. Although my one foot isn't as wide anymore because my husband ripped off half my pinky toe last year, remember? Just kidding. My whole <laughs> just kidding. I have one of my toes, but I'm just saying. Oh my gosh. If you guys remember that story, that was oh oh my God. Card at Hobby Lobby, yes. Yes, that was hilarious. Do you guys remember that story? Okay. So uh, let's do the fabric tack. Fabric tack. Did you hear that? The fabric packs. Yeah, way oh, I got a big last night and pick my favorite. Okay. Yeah. So, all my right. son wears a size 14. He is 6'5. The Hubs is 6'5. So is Mason. Yep. And he super wears bad. a 13 or a 14, depending on the shoe. It's super yep. not fun. So not fun. And his feet, oh my God, you guys, he should just wear the shoe boxes, I swear. His feet are so clear. <laughs> I swear, he should, honestly, if he could, if I could just talk him into wearing the shoe boxes, it'd be so much easier. I'm reading chat, you guys. I'm just tack for horses. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. We are. So let me open one of these up. You guys know normally when I do these, I do other stuff to go with them. I coordinate, you know, some trims and all that kind of stuff. This time I decided to just do them with the fabric. Well, I get this fabric. Everything is either, well, I'll tell you when it's different. They're either quarter, fat quarters or half a yard. So, and I didn't do quarter yards because a fat quarter actually gives you more to work with depending on what you're using them for. You could make a pillow, you know, the front cover of a pillow, um, journal covers, that kind of thing. So like you're not limited to just journals if you want to do anything else with them. So this piece is a fat quarter. So there's an idea of what the butterfly piece looks like. Love that. Isn't that pretty? I love this one. Mm -hmm. So there's that as a fat quarter. Okay, I'm going to get them folded back upright. Okay, this piece is also a fat quarter. And this is an, it's the most interesting color gray. It's got just a tiny hint of green to it, so it leans to a green if you put it next to green. So there's that one. Then we have a half a yard of this piece. So there's that one. Don't remember how I had it folded. Hold tight. Let me figure it out. That's about right. Then there's this one and there's a half a yard of this piece. And this is a gray. This is like a really pretty charcoal color. So there's that one. Then there's this. Mm -hmm. And there's a half a yard of this one. We've got the different. Um, and this is, again, like a, like a charcoal with just a tiniest little blue shade to it. And then 
this is all like charcoals. Well, this is actually like black where his um, feathers are. And then this is a nice gray tone. This is like a that green like that this was. It gray, but with the tiniest shading of green is what this is in these flowers. This is a gray. This is that stone green gray color. This is um, a really pretty actual stone color, like that stone brown putty kind of color. Um, so there's that piece. So pretty. Isn't that pretty? I love that one. And then this is, see how nice that matches mm -hmm. with all of these colors? Mm -hmm. This is a faux leather, but it's a really nice faux leather. And it feels like suede on the inside. It's not like just a poly fabric backing that's on a lot of them. This feels like suede. Um, and this is that, you know, it's going to lend toward the greens if you put it with greens. It's got that... <clears throat> little bit of brown, little bit of gray thing going on. It's just a nice, nice neutral. So the texture. Yeah. I, you know, you guys know I like to play with my fabrics. See if I can get mm -hmm. these back up correctly. Oh so, wow. Wait till you see. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She did pick out a favorite one. She did. Oh, it's gorgeous. All right, so these are going to, I have four of them. I just did, there's, I did four of each one except one. And that one, there's only two, but I'll tell you when we get to it. Um, these are going to be 17 a pack. It's like a gray bundle? Yeah, we'll call it, or you can call it birds or whatever, gray birds or. It's gone in a fabric pack. Whatever makes you happy over there. <laughs> Every demon would like to know if they're cotton. Yes, they are cotton. I'm sorry. Yes, they are. And everything other than the leather is like a nice, geez, Louise, you'd think I'd never done this before, is um, like, a, like an upholstery weight canvas. Does that make sense? But they're cotton, yes, except for the leather piece. Uh, good night, Laurel. Good night, Laurel. Okay, my. All right, those are all sold. Let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. Oh, no, no. Go back um, hey, hey, Stephanie. Okay. Esme. Thank you, Esme. Amanda. Oh, thanks, Tammy. Just wait, Tammy. Just wait. And okay. Kathy Beige. Awesome. Thanks, Kathy. Okay. So. She that, actually that. heard me. She said, LOL. She heard me. Yeah, the word comes through better than you think. So then there's this one. This one was super fun too. Oh, I love this one. Oh, there's, I, there's, let me just, there's one, not one that I don't like because they're <laughs> and if, just all so cool, but I do have a favorite. <laughs> and if this makes you think of Minnie Mouse, it should. Um, remember when I said I used to do little girls um, pageant clothes? I I oh I can't even tell you how many Minnie Mouse outfits I made. Yes, um, that is red, red, Sherilyn. Yes, it is totally red. Absolutely, this is Minnie Mouse red. There's a half a yard of this. Then this is the tool leather faux leather. Ooh, that is black. Cool. And there's a fat quarter of this. And some of these fat quarters are really generous because I just took the piece of fabric that I had and cut it into fours. So if it's over a fat quarter, so so it was. Um, this is a, it is navy, 
because it's one of those, is it black, is it blue? Is it black, is it blue? And they always say, if you have to wonder, it's blue. And as soon as you put it down next to the black, it looks blue. So this is a navy, tiny, tiny gingham print. And this is a, um, hang on. This is a generous fat quarter, this one. Then this is a half a yard. And these are all cotton fabrics also. Everything is cotton or faux leather. I'm looking to make sure there's one piece. Hang on. There's one piece that is not cotton and it's a poly, it's a poly blend and it's in the gold pack. So otherwise everything is cotton. Yeah, I'm looking. Everything is cotton. Oh, and there's one with bark cloth. So we have mm -hmm. one with bark cloth and one with a poly blend. Otherwise, we're all cotton with the exception of the faux leather. So here's this one. And there's a half a yard of this. Did I have that piece folded just in half? I think I did. Sorry, you guys, but I can't help it. I have to get them put back correctly or it drives me a little bonkers. This is um, vintage ticking. And this, oh, yeah. Yeah. And this is a generous fat quarter. I think it was, I think it's 20. No, wait, let me think. It's 8, 19. I cut it at 19. It's 19 wide and like 25 long. So it's a little more than a fat quarter on that one. So there's that one. This one is so cute. And then there's a half a Nope, a fat quarter. There's a fat quarter of this. With all the little farm stuff going on. Okay. So this one is going to be, and all of them. Oh, did I need to type this in? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I, I was watching the show. I have extra time to package. Um, all of these packs are going to be 17. Yeah, all of them are 17. And you have four available of each until you tell me the two, right? There's only one that I have two of, yes. Okay. Word. Just for me to know when you're ready over there, Lane. Okay, I just gotta get the air out of the bag. You have to get it perfect. Well, I do, and then I just realized I'm folding backwards. I'm sorry, you guys. If I don't get that air out now, it won't come out by the time I get it all folded on itself. Okay. Stephanie said, my last invoice was six bucks. I'm clearly slacking. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hilarious. All right, you ready? Yep. Jennifer Jane. Thanks, Jennifer. Sherilyn. Thank you, Sherilyn. And oh, deep. one available. It was the farm critters that did you in, wasn't it, you guys? <coughs> you know it was. Okay. I just need to price this one. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Okay. Reaching back here. Oh, that's right, Stephanie. Your mom's there. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? That's right. Her mom's in town. That's right. Nice. Her mom's there. That's right. Oh, 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 oh. oh. This is the one Michelle doesn't like, you guys. The, oh, my gosh. Okay, so this is the one that has the poly. I decided to grab it. So, oh, there's two in here that are not cotton. Who? good call, Evadine. Thank you for reminding me. I don't know where my brain was. Um, so this 
is obviously a poly blend. But can you um, see? There it is. And I think at one time these were curtains. That's Isn't gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? There is a hem in it on this I can, on this end. I can't even look at this one. Oh, yeah. Stephanie, your daughter's moving back to you. House full. Nice. So this piece measures just short of half a yard. Um, then there's this one, which is, this is a fat quarter. So it's birds again, but they're slightly different. You've got a little bit of postage stamps going on, a little bit of a postcard image. This is just nice. It's yellows and grays and charcoal. And the yellows are like a nice, soft mustard. Yeah, we'll go with that. A nice, soft mustard. I like that. And I am not a yellow girl, and this is hot. I like it. A lot. She likes me. All right, then we've got this Paris print. And okay, hello. Mm hmm In grays and charcoals and white. And this is almost black. And this one's a fat quarter. Okay. Then there's this one. You get a half a yard of this one. This one, and this has a nice tiny scale to it. And you've got the metallic, the white, the grays, the charcoal, a little bit black. Yeah, this one's pretty. And there's a full half a yard of this one. Because this, I think this would be really pretty in a whole bunch of different projects. Like if you wanted to use it for home deck. Um, like for pillows or such, you could get a couple pillow backs out of it. You just do a lot. Jennifer would like to know if that mustard color is gray poupon. Um, almost actually, smarty pants. It is almost. <laughs> I like uh, that. These are not Melanie. Would like right. to know if you have an extra of the bird pattern. What? Melanie would like to know if you have any extra of just the bird pattern. Um. I don't believe so. If you and if I do, it's just it's like not much at all. Um, that's why some of these are really generous fat quarters, even though I'm saying fat quarters because I just cut whatever I had. That way, I didn't have a bunch of random pieces. Because the one thing I don't need in my life is more fabric, but that does not stop me from purchasing it ever. Um, and then I have. Oh. This one. I love this. Absolutely love this. I'm telling you. Absolutely love it. Um, and this this is the heavier weight home deck. Um, almost like a canvas weight to it. And there's a fat quarter of that one. <laughs> <That's nice. laughs> They're just not cooperating, you guys. What am I doing wrong? There it goes. Okay. And then this is just literally like a 12 by 12. And it's a, um, this is a tweed. And this is an upholstery weight. I just liked the colors with everything. So it had to be there because it's like perfect. It's got a little bit of green, a little bit of gray. And it's not like green, green. Just enough. Just works in there perfectly love yes so. love <sighs> whenever you're ready ma'am you are the neatest fabric folder i can't help it it has to be pretty, <clears throat> has to be pretty. And on my shelves, yeah. it has to be folded and stacked just right. Because I want to be able to. Bottom, yeah, curtain, bottom, curtain. 
just gorgeous. Yep, you like the bottom piece. One is sold to Stephanie Petit. Awesome. Are you Thank, you. Thank you, Stephanie. Esme did a great job putting those fabrics together. Thanks, Esme. <laughs> Which one was the oh the gray one? There might be another one you like. I because I did several. Do you guys still want me to open them all up, or do you just want to see them? Because I don't want to bore you guys. Oh my gosh! I love can, this one. I like this oh one. Oh my gosh! Um, I can. There's because there's this one and two more. Well, three more. Then there's this one. And this one. Let me bring them closer. And this one. Where's it at? Where's it at? That black one is the one I have two of. Well, Stephanie said, do it, do it. Okay. So. Let's do, if there's a tiny avalanche over there. <sighs> All right, so this, man, I was way off on my cottons. This is an upholstery poly blend also. And it's like a waffle. Can you get, see if I can cut, there it is. Oh, yeah. Mixture. So that's like a waffle weave in this one. Um, this one is a generous fat quarter. This one is the upholstery weight, um, like a canvas. There's a half a yard of this one. And then on this side, it's got the crowns and the postage, and you've got like a ticket, more postage. Love that. I think it's pretty. I like this Dude. one. I just can't. Okay, so there's that one. Then this is again like a um, like a canvas wave, a wave weave. I just liked it's it's like it's very French to me. This one is a generous fat quarter. There's that one. Then there's this one. Is that French country? I think this this mm -hmm. one is this one's a half a yard, so you get a full half on this one. That yellow and black set was the last one we did, right? Yes. Can you put Michelle Hartley on one of those, please? Sure. Michelle with two L's. Yep, Hardly. this one. Michelle, this one. Yes, that one. Perfect. Thank you, Michelle. So then you have this one. This one has a lot of the script and the Eiffel Tower and, you know, the stamps and different motifs. And the gigantic hot air balloon. There's that one. How did I have this? Where's this pack at even? There it is. Hot air balloons are my favorite. I know, right? Then this is another, um, like a, it's a little bigger. Let's call it, hang on. I'll just measure it. How about that? 14. So you're getting like a 14 inch square. And this again is an upholstery weight and it's got a, like a metallic. There it is. The gold metallic. And this is, these are red, like burgundy red. This one back here, the, the first one I showed you, it's like a wine burgundy color. And this is slightly redder with the gold. So there's that one. And then you get a fat quarter of mm. the chickens. And I don't know why these look so French to me, but they just 
do. They're so flipping cute. French they just, country. Yep, exactly. That's exactly what I was going to say too, Maggie. They, they're very, very French country to me. Yeah, I like when we have textile day and I can play with all of my fabrics. And if you guys even knew how much there was in there that I didn't even get to yet, I have the bundle sorted. <laughs> I have like uh, yeah, but you didn't get to the one the one that mm -mm. but I have like yeah, that ten, yeah, I have like ten more in the uh, to break down into sets for you guys. So yeah, there's mm -hmm. four of these. I'm sweating. <laughs> You're so goofy. Seriously, that. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Booty. Thanks, Steph. Oh, those are sold. Hi, Francis Armstrong. Hey, Francis. Um, Hi, Francis. Boutique, Paula Fowler, Esme, and Francis Armstrong. Awesome. Thank you very much, ladies. Thank oh, you. Lori, you came in right after my sold. Francis. How's work been, Francis? She's a busy girl, too. The chickens got you there, Esme? Yep. <laughs> yep, and Paula, too. I figured. Paula, too. too. Paula yep, chickens. they're cute. That's it. They are cute, for sure. That's a, that's a cute bundle. Okay, so then this one, there's only... She said, we're been busy. Yeah. There's only two of this one. And this one is an upholstery weight. And it's a black with a gold. And it's not like that in your face gold. It's like old gold. Mm. Okay. I don't have the name of this one. That's beautiful bundle. Then this is another Italian print. There's a fat, is it a fat? Yes, a fat quarter of this one. Oops. French. I, I love those. I Well, these you can do some, I mean, can you imagine the fabric tags and stuff you can make with all these labels? Mm -hmm. I, yeah, these are fun to play with for sure. Oh, I love the next one too. <laughs> Look at Meg sneaking ahead. <laughs> <laughs> There's a half a yard of this one, which again has a lot of the French and European influence. Mm -hmm. So you've got a half a yard of this one. What's up, Nikki? She said, hey, why don't I come in on the French stuff? Well, I don't know. You must it must have made your ears ring. So this is an embroidered. There's a full half a yard of this one. Um, yeah, that one. It's yummy. That's it is yummy. Yeah, and this is the I used this in a kit quite a while ago, or one of these fabric bundles quite a while ago. Um, and this is the last of it. And then the yeah. other half. So it's like a hem. You know what I mean? Where you get this, and there's like 20 inches. Maybe well, we'll call it 18. 18 from here to here and then this is the salvage edge so this would have been like the hem on like a skirt or whatever if you were gonna but i bought it as yardage so um then the rest of the width of the fabric is just the black cotton if that no, i don't think we had any egyptian stuff there francis maggie sold first um tammy is saying horses Horses, horses. <laughs> and then here is horses emojis for you. Awesome. <laughs> Those are for Francis because Francis works on a horse farm. 
So I'm going to go with that. This is a nice black. Hang on. Let me see if I can catch it. There it is. Yep. It's like an embossed fabric. This stuff is so pretty. Is that better? I know you guys are not getting the detail on this at all, but there's not. Okay. It's showing up on you. Okay, because it is just so pretty. Um, this is like this is like a generous fat quarter on this one also. And then this piece is a full half yard. And again, just lots of fun little pieces to cut and play with. Oh, this is great. Mm-hmm. There's flowers. There's flowers. What? Two of these, yes? Yes, only two. She said horse fabrics exist. <laughs> well, I will look for them. I was trying to pretend like you were not yelling at me, Tammy. I was really trying to play that off. Dang it, I almost made it, too. <laughs> I can hear her saying that. You know, Patty, horse fabrics do exist. I, I can know. hear her. Oh, saying that. Oh, oh you gotta reload. As me and Jennifer Jane reload because it's not in yet. I'm hovering over the button just a second. Here we go. Yeah, I really was trying to play that off. You caught that though, huh? Oh my gosh. How did you guys reload that fast? I have no idea. That was going to <laughs> Jennifer Jane and Esme. <laughs> Jennifer Jane and Esme? Yep. They awesome. came in before I even put it in, told them to reload, and bam, they were first. Nice. Nice job. Nice job. Lori, you might want to refresh, honey. You keep coming in right after my soul. Make sure your live is on the red. And make and sure you're in live, live chat. chat. Yeah. Live chat, not top chat. Oh, my gosh. When I was at Mary's sale last weekend or whichever um, day it was. Was great to see you soon. Oh, I spent so much time. Thank you, Francis. I spent so much time in top chat. Oh my gosh, I was so beyond irritated. It really slows down the whole process. Yep. So much better in the lives if you watch the chat instead of listening to our voices because of the lag. Okay. If you hover it be um, right over the bottom where Patty's email is, you'll see a live button. If that button is not red, click live. And make sure your chat is on live. Yeah, at the top of the chat gotta box. Be on live. Yeah, at the top of the chat box, there's a a live chat or a top chat. You want to be in live chat. It's just a mm -hmm. little bit more on time. So this is the bark cloth. That bark cloth is beautiful. Mm -hmm. And this yeah. is this is a nice, generous fat quarter piece. Like this width on this one is, so it's like 22 by 26, I think. So there's, well, let's see. So it's 22 by 40. So yeah, it's a nice, generous fat quarter size there, but I'm still just calling it a fat quarter. It was the piece I had, and I made it work in for um, four bundles. Then there's this, and you get a full pack, pack, right? Yeah, there. Yes, the, everything else is four again. So then there's this. You get a full half a yard of that. There's this stripe. There's a full half yard of this. There's the butterflies. And the moths. I think some of these are moths, not butterflies. Jamie Burke cloth is made out of mulberry tree. The bark very, of mulberry tree. Very hard to find. Yep. So yeah, I don't believe I believe they make it now, but it's blended with cotton. It's not the same. This one's a fat quarter. And then this one is a full half yard. And again, more fussy cutting of the fabric. And oh, this yes. has just a little Very bit pretty. of gold in the, there it is. 
Can you guys see the gold? Whoops. Right, right here. There's the, the writing. The script is in. Is there? You can see it when it bends a little. Is in the gold. So, and there's that one. Watch the chat, ladies. Here we go. Oh, sold. Look who learned how to use her computer. You go, Lori. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Lori, tell, yeah. Lori, tell the truth. Is Michelle not the best cheerleader ever? I mean, seriously. <laughs> can she, she can Game make it. She got it. <laughs> yep. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Let me know when you're ready, Lane. Almost. Hang tight. Let me get the basket up here. See, this is how I've got them sorted for you guys. Okay, whenever you're ready, ma'am. And look who came in first. Jamie. Jamie? Yep. Awesome. Okay. Proceed. Okay. Paul Fowler. Oh, and I was going to tell you guys, anybody who shopped Monday and tonight from with me, um, you may have two boxes. If it winds up being better shipping, um, I may separate them and do everything from Monday night media mail and then do tonight's stuff um, in a because it can't go media. So don't be surprised if you see two different shipping boxes. Lucky number four, Girl on Ridge, Lori. Awesome. Thanks, you guys. Thank you very much. Thanks, Laura. Lori. Lori. Uh, wait till you see this bark cloth, Jamie. It's it's incredible. It's fantastic to work with, too. It is. You're gonna if you like texture, you're gonna it's and as soon yeah. as you know what it is, if you're out and about and like I don't know if you go thrifting and stuff, but once once you know what it is, you can almost spot it a mile away. It is so authentically mid-century modern. It's, mm -hmm. it's amazing stuff. And the prints are usually very, um, lots and lots of foliage. You'll see birds. Um, you'll see other prints, but there's a lot of like nature or outdoors kind of stuff. It's, it's neat. It's really neat. Don't know if you saw that, Minda. Tammy Minda. Tammy, Tammy Minda. I happen to have some fabric with horses on it. It does exist, Patty. It does <laughs> exist, Michelle. No way. Look. It does exist. Look, there's fabric with horses on it. <laughs> is she here? Where is she? She hasn't said anything yet. She probably took the dog out. She's going to be. she fell asleep. Why she fell asleep? She fell asleep. No, there she is. There she is. <laughs> Look at all these horses. Look at all these horses. Look at all them horses, Benda. Do you see how do you know how hard it was to be quiet and not tell you if you just be patient? <laughs> oh my gosh. That was awesome. We could not have explained that any better. That was awesome. Okay. <laughs> Hang on a second. I'm not getting this. I know, right? After she called me out, I was like, um, oh, she's I'm not saying anything. <laughs> yep. I was like, she's just going to have to wait now. Okay. These were curtains, like valance curtains. You get two in each, each bundle. And they're like, let's see here, 20 by 20. And they have the hems in them still. But I love the prints. So you get two, two pieces. So basically two fat quarters. 
it was just cute and it had to just had to go with you know they have to be wild horses now so blah on this one she said well they are kind of wild no she doesn't like them when they have reins on them she likes okay. them hi rosemary morris i think it's cheating to get particular now you asked for horses <laughs> I did. <laughs> you asked for horses. That's cheating. So uh, cheating. you asked, and in a matter of moments, I supplied said request. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying. I think that's cheating. Okay. So here's the tool, the faux, the faux tool leather. Oh, love that. Oh, We're going to go with a fat quarter size on that one. We're going to call that one a fat quarter. This one, you actually get a whole yard. And this is a nice vintage calico. I'm just ignoring them, you guys. I'm just moving on. Then this, you get a fat quarter. And this is um, love this. our boxes. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? That is so cool. I just tried to stick a little bit with a theme on this one. So there's that That's one. Cool. And Wait, then, I, this is my favorite pack. Yeah, with that. Yeah. Yeah. I was waiting for you to wake up over there. Yeah, this was my favorite pack. Mm -hmm. And yes, Jennifer, these are oranges. Anything in this set that looks like orange is orange. So I kind of, you know, was aiming for you and Tammy, but since she's going to be too fussy, There'll be an extra. So, and this is a really nice, I don't even know what to call. This is a poly. This one we're going to call a poly blend, by the way. So, but this is really, this is authentically vintage too, by the way. This piece, I don't think this, it's printed along with salvage and I looked it up, but this is a genuine vintage. Um, and the company's not even in business anymore. So, anywho, there's four of these available. Oh, it has to be wild orange. Okay, never mind then. Wait for your reason. Nikki um, wants to know if the cigars are from Cuba. <laughs> um, I, you know, I, I don't know because I, I don't, I can't speak or read Cuban, so I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, you guys, my feelings are not hurt. Everybody. Oh my God. I think it's hilarious. I love it. <laughs> Tammy, you just wait. I'm gonna buy like you just wait, Tammy. Minda, I'm gonna get you in your wild no reins on fabric yet. You watch. I don't care if I gotta draw them on there myself. You just watch. <laughs> And let me warn you, I don't even know how to, I'm not a good drawer, so it could be really scary stuff. It could be the weirdest stick figure horse you're, you've ever seen. You're going to feel gonna really say stick figure horse. Yep. She's going to feel so oh, obligated. Yeah. Yep. You guys just wait. Just It'll be awesome. Put a saddle and don't put reins on it. Yep. Oh my gosh. My stomach hurts. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer. Oh my God. She is Jamie, I have to practice oh, first. I'm gonna have to you don't understand. I am not a freehand drawer. I'm not. Oh it is not goodness. gonna look at her go on her computer now. We told her all the rules. She's just gonna get it. 
<laughs> All right, first one for Jane with that wild orange, please. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'll Ooh. keep all the tame orange here and send you only the wild. Okay. The free range, the free range orange. Okay, Petite. Yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, Lori Fusco. And Everdeen. Oh, yeah, you're going to miss some current Jennifer. That was. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to hold it in to pay her And here I was so proud. I had horses. Oh, no, they had to be without reins. Okay. Yes. yes. That's a very free range. Parisian is our favorite if you can find it. Okay. So. Let me see here. Um, 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 what do you guys, because it's almost 1030. I try to be off by 11 because Michelle has to get up for school tomorrow. Um, She's going to school. Yep. Um, honestly, what I pulled, you've kind of sort of seen. So there was the 10 yards of the bobbin lace. There's this tablecloth, I don't really want to, I, I know I talked about doing Build-A-Bundles, but I feel like if I do Build-A-Bundles, I might do them Monday. We might start with them Monday. That way we have time. Quickies, go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my gosh, you guys. That was so fun that night. Um, That was fun. It was fun. That was, was fun. fun. Yeah. Money in and boom. Yep, I've got some ideas for that. You guys just hang tight with that idea. Oh, look at this thread right there. Um, this piece, I I want to say that it was hand done. I'm just, uh, I feel like the embroidery is too perfect to say that it's, it's hand done. Beautiful. It is gorgeous. But I know that this is bobbin lace. And this thing is big, like, it's huge. This is this is one corner. That's then, gorgeous. Yeah, look at that. <clears throat> wow. And if yeah, I, I mean it. if anybody's interested in this, I'll measure it. <clears throat> it's a tablecloth. It's a tablecloth, but it's enormous. Um so there's 60. So it's 64 long by by 64. So it's 64 by 64. And I'm now officially opening the whole thing up in my lap. So just one moment. So you've got two different borders on it. So here's the very outer border. And then you've got this row of the bobbin lace that runs all the way around the entire outer edge. And see, here's the inside. And this is why you're going to, I think you're all going to agree with me that this whole thing is machine made. Somebody could have done this at home on their machine, but I just really feel like this was factory made. Um, and then here's the next, this is an inner corner. <clears throat> So you actually have eight of these applique sections. So here's here's the inner corner. There's the outer corner. Okay. So there's, wow. there's yeah, you have, and then this trim goes all the way around this inside, this inside. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. so it really is. is. Yeah. <clears throat> it's a tablecloth, Jamie. Yep. It's a tablecloth. So, yeah, it is, it is really, really pretty. So, I just need to know if anybody's interested. Not, we, I'm not even, I am not reading chat anymore. <laughs> just <laughs> typing. It's what? I'm just typing. I'm not reading it anymore. Are they being ridiculous? Jamie is being hilarious. Awesome. 
continue with the hilarity because I will come back and reread it. I will say I mute myself though, because I think it's the weirdest thing in the world to listen to myself, <laughs> but I will mute it and come back and read chat when I know that it was especially hilarious. Yeah, it's, it's all machine done. It's all machine done factory made. Um, and it's 64 by 64. It is not hand done, but it is really, really pretty bobbin style. That's beautiful. Bobbin style lace. So I just need to know if anybody's interested in it. If you are, I can flat price this one. <clears throat> yep, I can flat price this one. Yep, fur. Okay, hey, what power? <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's just do it. We'll just put it in. So oh, I was yeah. do, okay, so I was gonna do um 35 on this one. Fish can't guess who got that. Paula Fowler. Correct, Amundo. Yep, the colors kind of gave this one away. This one is Paula all day. That's Paula all day. Yep. And she actually yep. uses these, you guys. She sent me pictures of her tables. They're mm -hmm. she does me too. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay, so this next piece, you guys may not even love it as much as I do. Oh, we might do. Hey, I might have an idea for closing. Oh, we might do a quickies yet. You want, hang tight. Let me think this through as I'm doing this. So this one is a giant, I want to say oval, but I can't remember if it's oval or circular. And this, Esme, what do you think? I want to say that this is machine done, but what do you think? Wow. She's the lace lady. If I got her That's here, amazing. it's it's absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Like I said, I want to learn. So when she's here, I'm asking. Oh, little circles on there. Mm-hmm. So I feel like it's probably machine made. <clears throat> it is absolutely Enormous. She said handmade. Awesome. 100. How can you call? How a thousand percent handmade. Awesome. Thank you, Esme. Um, because this is where I this is where I kind of wondered is where they've come. There's got this, and then you've got the extra layers. Mm -hmm. So I just and then the circles. But this thing is absolutely amazing, you guys. I've been over every inch of this thing. Um, I don't see a snag. I don't see a hole. I don't see a cut or broken thread. It said not machine. Grandma made this by hand. Well, it took Grandma 20 years because this thing is huge. Absolutely huge. Um, and it's, it really is. It's like perfect. I think it was made and stored. I oh, in Spain. Interesting. Nice. See, I knew I would get an education if I asked. Okay. So, okay. Let me, let me get it folded so I can try to get a rough. Like it's so big, I'm standing to fold it. And it is, it is, oh, oops, sorry. Oops. Earthquake, sorry. Kerplunk. Kerplunk. Okay. So I've got it folded in half this way, and it's 60, 
60 inches. So it's 120 inches long by. She said, if you Google it, you'll see it. Okay. Thank you, Esme. Thank you. It's 120 by 70. So definitely oval. Most definitely oval. And see, oh, here's. Yeah, I just want to put it out here with you guys. There's no way I can show you the whole entire thing, but I do want you to see the hem and the designs. Yeah, this thing, it really is very, very pretty. So this one I would really like to auction. Wow, it took her six months to make it. She made two. Nice. <clears throat> nice. Pretty when you are. Yep. And um let's just start this one at um let's just start it at all. Um yep. It's what we do around here. What I did. Okay, so I'm going to continue to fold. It's a big end. Yeah, it is. Super, <laughs> super nice. Still reminds me of that fillet stitch. I don't know why. Maybe the little squares. It Well, because it's open like a fillet switch. switch. Cheesel Pete's. It's open like a fillet stitch, so that kind of makes sense. To me, anyway. To mute myself and just <laughs> come on when you need my voice. I'm so funny, you guys. So funny. Like borderline ridiculous, <clears throat> I think. Yep, six months is half a year. <laughs> it sure is. I'm sorting. I'm pre-sorting. I'm getting ready. I want to do quickies. That'll be fun. It'll be a fun way to get Quickies are fun. Quickies were fun. Quickies were a good time. International night. Loved it. Textile night. Even funner. Just I fun. like the company on textile night and the hilarity oh that has been happening God. in the chat. Stomach is killing me. That... <laughs> Nikki the loves way that you read that. <laughs> oh, Jennifer, it has to be wild. <laughs> wild, 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 and wild, wild people. I just, <clears throat> oh my gosh, learn how to spell stop, Michelle. Yeah, Michelle, figure it Why out. Why they? <laughs> so that's on my, that's my best patty invitation. Oy vey. Oy vey. Oy vey. She always makes me sound so nasally. Am I really that nasally? Oy vey. Oy vey. <laughs> Well, that was a close one. That is sold to Esme for $80. Nice job. Nice. Thank you, Esme. I'm looking back now. <laughs> Woo, and Karen were neck and neck. Get you girls go. Good job, awesome. lady. Thank you, Esme. <clears throat> okay, so let's see here. These are going to be five dollar quickies. Instead five dollar quickies. Oh, I just got five dollars go right. Yes, and the first 
Well, it's going to be kind of between a build a bundle and a quickie. Okay. Michelle's going to type in $5 go. The first <clears throat> meeting as I'm putting things down gets the whatever it is. So this is a hand crochet. Yeah. Top. <clears throat> yeah go ahead. Whenever you're ready. This is a quickie. This is hand crocheted. It's got where you can run the ribbon through the Empire bus yeah, line. Okay. Zip it. That's Don't keep walking. <laughs> no, Come on, quickie. You can do it. Quickie, Lane. Quickie. I got to talk. It has to happen. No, no talking, no describing. Yes. On the table. Remember, we're not allowed to talk oh, about it. Oh, my gosh. Quickies are things you don't talk about. <sighs> <laughs> Wayne Bannon, you just, all right, you bossy just, pants. Bossy pants, you're holding me up. Who was it? I told you, Kathy Beige. I didn't hear you. You were too busy talking. <laughs> <laughs> now you reach over and hit Specker. Smacker. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now you know why she voted me number one, right, you guys? Okay. So <laughs> just saying. Okay. Okay, here we go. Five dollar quick in. Okay. So I'm not supposed to talk. I'm just laying things down. <clears throat> yep. Sold. Nasty dad, get it off the table. <laughs> you know, oh my god. I just want to tell you, turnabout is I so fair play. <laughs> turnabout is so fair play. You just wait. You just wait. I'm so in for it. I I. Love it. I she said, David said, you do talk about quickies afterwards to your friends. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So who was this? Um, Mousy Deb. Hey, Deb, can you remind me of the first initial of your last name, please? Because I so don't remember. I know I have it. I just don't remember. Okay. So ready? Yep. Okay. Here's another hand crocheted one. Hang on. I have to talk about this one because you got to see it. I think it's a pillowcase trim. Sold. Hey, <laughs> y'all ain't playing around. Um, Deb's last name is W. Okay, cool. And that is still Kathy Bush. Good night, Esme. Have a night. Uh, good night, hun. Thanks for coming. Thanks good night, for Esme. Coming. I know Nikki, she can't help herself. She has to talk about it. Okay, smarty pants. This one's a basket. If you stiffen it up, makes a flower basket. Here's your handle. That's cute. So, for goodness sakes, Nikki. Okay. I think that goes on the back of a chair. What do you guys think? I'll slide through there quick. Yes. I'm waiting for YouTube to catch up here. Hold on. Nope. I'm going. You said it's quick. <laughs> be quick. <laughs> Don't be talking. <laughs> this one. It's got a little bit of blue on the end. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Mary. Zebra. Awesome. Thank you, Mary. <clears throat> Natasha says, let's see how many she can lay down with zero description. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's killing her, Natasha. You said Mary, right? Yes, Mary Sieber. Well, you know, you guys, half the time, it's like my, my thought is I'm... I have to describe it to you. How do you know what you're getting if I'm not describing it to you, right? So Nikki says, Nikki says do I smoke now that I got my quickie? <laughs> yes. I would say yes. It would be appropriate. <clears throat> okay. So, all right, you guys. You asked for it. You're going to get it. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, it's a baby bonnet. Sold. Karen Thompson. Awesome. Thank you. Oh, can I talk at the end? <laughs> you may say thank you. Yes. Absolutely. Thanks, Karen. <laughs> it's so weird not to tell you guys what things are. It's weird. <laughs> well, Very Karen weird. loves baby, baby clothes. So, yeah, that was a good one. Tammy says, oh, that half is Michelle. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Real funny. You can get my own horses. All right, you ready? Yep. Here's your fillet. Hey, Michelle, up. I think this is the fillet pattern, just so you know. <laughs> is it? I was called that the spider web. It is. I was just being a smart aleck. <clears throat> Sold. Oh, Mary Zebra. Thank you, Mary. Oh, I can see her eyes. No, you can't. You just think Ooh, you can. Look at all those knees after that. They like that. <clears throat> no, your eyes are like, I can't talk. <laughs> Um, hold on real quick, real, real quick. Esme said, can you, um, please send the tablecloth to Paula, please? I absolutely oh, nice. that. Absolutely. That's so, awesome. $5 awesome. quickie yet. So if you, I don't know if you want to write a note real quick. I'll, I'll remember. I will remember. Okay. Esme, Esme to Paula. that was amazing. Thank you. That was amazing. That's very nice, Esme. Jamie says she's annoyed with us. Sold. <laughs> Why are you annoyed with us? What did I do now? No, she said you're annoyed with with that, that us. Oh no, it's just because you can't I talk. Know, I get to legit give you guys a hard time. That's I'm actually totally enjoying myself because <laughs> I can be sarcastic and not get in trouble. That's sold to Mary. Because I usually try to be super careful and make sure that um, my sarcasm doesn't get me in trouble or hurt someone's feelings. And tonight, I can just be totally sarcastic, and everybody's having fun with it. Jamie says, we like it quick. <laughs> me, me, well. <clears throat> Ooh, that's pretty. That's the Irish word. I like that one. Oh, look. And before they can get, grab it, I'm going to put this lace in there with that's it. That's beautiful. It's just a really pretty... Simple little trim. Oh. Nikki. Okay, awesome. Thanks, Nikki. <laughs> Natasha says, you use a filter? What's that like? <laughs> well... <laughs> You know, public Aaron's to loving these quickies. Look at all these me's. Oh my goodness. Public to the world is a whole lot different than, you know. Oh, this is awesome. All right, hang on one second, you guys. I gotta move these bags because they're about to fall over and stuff will fall out and that won't look well. At all. Okay. Okay. Peacocks. Ooh. Peacock. Pretty. Sherilyn wants to know who came up with this idea. Well, it just because we were on the other night and we were gonna go, and they're like, just sell them really quick. So we just did quickies. Yep. Yeah. I just, oh, uh, oh my gosh, look at all these me's. Um that is sold to Mousy Deb, who is Deb W. Okay. Gotta be quick, Esme. Gotta be quick. <clears throat> okay, so this one's going to be a little different. I have absolute, I have no idea. Maybe somebody else does. I got no idea. Definitely hand crocheted, though. Sherilyn is taking credit for the quickie. 
There you go. It might have been Sherilyn. I don't remember who it was. I really, really don't. But it was fun and it was silly. And she because said that was being silly, that is so. Yep. Yep. But because it was silly, it was fun. It was tremendous. Yep. The okay. show was. Go for that. That sold to Karen, Karen Thompson. Awesome. Thanks, Karen. Yeah, it was um, those little baby books. Yep. The well, night of the baby books. Yep. You're right. Small books. Yeah. And you were like, oh, we'll just wait till next Monday. They were like, uh uh. -huh. We want a quickie. Well, they sure got one. Mm -hmm. She said, you're welcome, Patty. Thanks. Then I'm going to put this one with them. And this, I don't know if this is supposed to be a toilet seat cover. I don't know what the deal is. But this one will not lay down flat. It looks like it so, needs a Okay. But you're getting this one, too. So you figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kelsey, Deb, W, you figure it out. You figure it out. You want to make sure on the page of it on your toilet seat. I just, I don't understand it. It just doesn't, I, whatever. I don't get it. Uh, as May said, thanks, uh, Betty. She does so much for me each week. This is the least I can do for her, for Paula. I understand. Very um, nice. Please yeah. take care of the help. That's what you do. <laughs> Most of the time, till they get too bossy and lippy, and you know, <laughs> little. Hey, I didn't make up this game. Sherilyn's taking. Look, look at her backpedal now. Now you hear her backpedaling, right? Oh, what, the, the, the. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. That is really pretty, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can't even get sold typed in. That's old. Okay. Uh, that's sold to Nikki. Sherilyn says, nope, I own it. <laughs> <laughs> She's totally owning it. You should. It's fun. Yep. The $5 quickie. Goodness, we started build the bundles here, what, a year and a half ago? A year ago? Yeah. I don't know how hard. I missed it, but I'm first time I'm seeing this. The quickie? Yeah. It was, oh, you went to bed, Megs. That's right, because we were wrapping Aww. up. We were okay, wrapping Daddy. up. You ready? Yeah. This is going to be a bunch of bits. Bunch of bits. Yep. A bunch of bits. All right, Esme, we love you, too. Have a good night. Hi, Esme. Thank you, Esme. Thank you. It's a bunch of bits that sold. Okay, you get all these little spider webby guys too. Sold to Karen Thompson. Awesome. Thank you, Karen. Um, that last one that Nikki got. Uh huh. Can you send it to Jamie, please? No. Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> 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 totally just care. Just kidding. Totally oh just caring. Totally. And writing Karen and trying to say kidding. Holy cow. <clears throat> Send no. you, who am I sending it to? Jamie. Jamie. You guys are the best. I love, <laughs> them. love them all. Thanks, Nikki. So I got it on there. Is that right? Yeah, I really was just kidding. I just wanted to say no and act like I meant it for a minute. Okay, so. I think Jamie says some nice ladies here. I'm telling you. Good so group. the one that didn't sell. Ooh, let's put this pack stuff back out. The one that didn't sell earlier. Ooh. No leftovers. Whoa. Sold. Okay. Karen Thompson. Awesome. Ooh, look at y'all. Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> even Maggie jumped in on that. <laughs> <laughs> I jumped. That's the third one I've jumped in on, and I'm just I didn't my lag is bad. Other ones. Oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness. And you have an advantage because you can see her on StreamYard, don't you? Or are you watching just straight YouTube? I'm on YouTube. You know what though? It didn't help because I was watching. No, it doesn't StreamYard. help. I had to get on my I had to get in on my iPad to even have a fighting chance. That's why I was like, never mind. Never mind. You still have to wait for your go. Yep. Michelle, on sure YouTube, do. So. so this yep. one's a little more than a yard. This is that. And it is vintage, but it is definitely machine made, just so that you know. And this is like, let's see here. Ooh, five inches. Five inches wide. Sold. Okay. Kathy Beige. <laughs> Jennifer Jane. Jennifer. I'm still eating, LOL. Who abandons their dinner for a quickie? <laughs> I can think of several guys who would do that and not think twice. Exactly. Oh. Okay. So then here's this, the embroidered piece with the oh, bobbin thread at the bottom. Pretty. Yep. This one. Jamie says, Jennifer, we all do. <laughs> Got to wait for my five my five dollar quickie man that sold to Shauna. Okay. Thank you, Shauna. You got a lonely little blue doily there. I do, but it's not as lonely as you might think. Here's the tiniest baby hat or a coin uh, purse. I really think this was a coin purse. Because look, there was a leather lining in here or parchment, but I think it was like a leather. But this stuff is like super hard. But I really think this was an old vintage <clears throat> coin purse is what so, I really think this was. Oh, and the little blue doily is going with it because there's blue on this. <laughs> Jamie says, my inner, she said, you guys are quick or my internet sucks and my husband works for the company. We shouldn't have this problem. I agree. For him. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this one for? Karen Thompson. Okay. Thanks, oh Karen. Oh, you guys cracked me up. Okay. So more little bits. Somebody started things and, oh, this is little embroidered flowers. Little doily. Okay. So then we're going to move into big doilies. Sold. Okay. But I couldn't could get him on that computer. Good. Glory, yes. Good job, Glory. Okay, so you guys emptied out the bin. Like, no joke. Emptied out the Thank bin. God. Hey, um, cookies are good. They are. Here's what's left. Doilies. Do you nice. want me? Yeah. Do you guys want me to count them? Do you want me to see how many there are? Do you want? These are different. So there's, there's these. And this Ooh, one has a flaw. Yeah. And these measure on average. Let's see here. Five, five inches wide, those. These measure six inches. These are between six and six and a half, this one. So <laughs> what I want to know is, is, do you guys want me to do, what do you guys think is fair? Do you want two for five? Do you want to do them by the each? Do you want to do three for five? What do you guys think? While they're thinking, Jennifer Jane says, I've been trying to eat all night. I'm starving. I don't have any energy for a quickie. Unless Keanu Reeves knocks on my door wearing a trench coat. Well, there's that. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Do not disagree. Um, she said, yeah. Sherilyn said, each with limit of two. 
Oh, Nikki, hold on. <laughs> okay, so let me see. There's one, two, three. 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 Did you guys know I could count to three so successfully? Very good. Okay, so this one has four. Hmm. That one has three. Three. Okay, so that one has three. That one has three. That one. That one. It's like watching someone play the memory game. <laughs> I know it is. Look how good job at this, Lang. And I'm good at it, huh? Yeah. Look at you go. Look at me go. All right. So. Jamie said, or you could just send each of us one, you know, like a party gift because we're so entertaining. <laughs> you know what? I actually do have bonus things ready for you guys tonight. Everybody will get a bonus in their package this week. Um, ooh. Ooh. Um, so, yeah. So let's do these. Four dollars for three. Four dollars for three, and you have seven of them. Yes, yeah, one per person. One per person. So you have two of the six inch ones and one of the five inch ones. Okay, so I'm taking the first seven people. Correct. Good. I'm talking slow. Good luck, ladies. Get your me's in. Here we go. Boom. Okay. And while you're doing that, I need to bag them so that. Hi, Christine. Hey, Christine. This old. Okay. Hang tight. Oh, wow, that worked out perfectly. Now we have just enough time for a giveaway. Yep. That was a good quickie, ladies. Whew, I am spent. Nice job. I think I need a beer and a cigar. <laughs> Corona, no lime, please, and a fresh Cuban would be great. Jamie says, who has a smoke? We all need one. <laughs> Sherilyn, I do not. <laughs> okay, whenever you're ready, ma'am. Deb said, burn them if you got them. <laughs> right? <laughs> all right, here we go. Ready? Kristen yep. Z. Hey, Kristen, did you just get here? Or have you been hanging out? Uh, Karen Thompson. Okay. Nikki. Okay. Mousy Deb W. Okay. Jamie. That's like I hit puberty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Kathy Beige. Okay. Lori F. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Now so let me see what we're going to do. Right there. All right. Don't anybody go anywhere because we're going to do a giveaway. Hang tight. Nobody leave. Nobody goes anywhere. Stay there. Paul wants to a glass of wine and a cigarette, please. <laughs> trying to decide what to do. What to do, what to do, what to do. Um, so, Nikki gave her a glass of wine and a cigarette. Oh my gosh, those emojis are adorable. Hang on, hang yeah, on. Maybe you got one. She's like, yes. 
So maybe your husband will get lucky tonight. Good job. Your internet was working. OMG, wait a <laughs> <you know. laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> filters, ladies, filters, just things on the internet for the rest of your lives. Anyway, <laughs> just kidding. Have fun. I don't really care. I just wanted to. I just, I've been, <laughs> ah, ah. Paul said, "Not for children." So did Sherilyn. Not for children. Okay. Does anybody like Chenille? Oh, Raise yeah. your hand if you like Chenille. Me. That's pretty. It is really, really pretty. I've got all the triangular weird offcut pieces. I'm going to make big pillows out of them. Okay. These are giveaways. When you see a price tag on them, don't think I'm weird. They were priced at the market. These are the ones I have left. So it is what it is. Michelle asked them a really, really hard question. And the first three right answers win. You got it. Super hard. Just kidding. I don't care. Yep, that's what I meant by really hard. Way to take a cue. Got him. Okay. Jamie, Natasha, Sherilyn. Awesome. It was on Thursday, correct? Yes, oh, ma'am. They're saying quickies. <laughs> we are going to do a quickie night, you guys. We are. Because I want to use quickie in the title so bad I can't stand it. Oh, yeah. That so one to get a lot. Uses get disappointed when they come to it. If anybody else uses it first, call them out. I want to do a giveaway, too. Okay. <laughs> Tammy, stay no, there. No more. I'm just kidding. <laughs> totally kidding. Okay, I got two more because I need to get this. These are the last. Some of you will remember these. This is the last two of these. <clears throat> these were um, like kind of like a slow stitch or just a journal cover kit kind of thing. And there's a big piece of the chenille in the back of these two. So here's the deal. The ones earlier were for anybody. These are for people. The only people eligible for these two are the people that already have fabric packs because these are enormous and it'll be easier for me to ship them and just pay the little bit of extra in your in your um, other packaging. Does that make sense? So <clears throat> that's what those are for. These are for who? Only if you bought a fabric pack. Only if you bought a fabric pack. Yep. Jamie says, welcome trolls to quickie. All right, here's my question. Get ready. Sherilyn and Jamie, did you both awesome. buy fa fabric packs? I know Jamie did. <laughs> I think I remember writing Jamie. both names. I know Jamie yep. did. I'm positive did. I wrote yep. Sherilyn's. Yep. And so did Sherilyn. They both awesome. did. Very good. Nikki, awesome. you are a question. There you go. And you guys, um, there's going to be some awesome giveaways on Monday, too, because I've been cleaning out. And my son is going to come and spend the whole day with me tomorrow, and we're going to tunnel our way through some of the trailers so i have a hunch there's going to be lots of lots of cool giveaways coming Ooh, that's going to be fun yeah yeah yep for all right mags you want me to switch it to you honey are you ready sure okay we're going to switch back over to maggie there it is i almost forgot how <laughs> okay there's a bag of mixed doilies You just nice. got one thing, Megs? Mm-hmm. I think that's a pretty nice giveaway right there. Nope, that means I can do my number thing. I love it. All right, here, it's, I'm putting it in chat. Okay. Our private chat, do you see it? Yep, yep I see it. it. All right. 
Keep guessing until you get it. One to 100, ladies, for that big, luscious bag of doilies right there. Good luck. Well, that's okay, Sherilyn. You can. You didn't have to buy anything from me. Anyone can go. Yeah, I just did those two big packs that way because otherwise I would pretty much have to send them in um, a bubble envelope. You know what I mean? This way I can just pay the weight difference stop, 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 stop. in the regional rate boxes. Stop, 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 stop. I was going to click the banner, but you're doing such a good job. Stop, stop, stop. All right. You ladies know the number, right? Yes, yes. ma'am. <laughs> Did somebody get it right on? Yeah. Okay. okay. Go ahead and say it, Megs. Do you What's see that? it? Um, I didn't see who it is. No. Oh, I know who it is. You want me to say okay. it? Yeah, go yeah, ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I see it. It, it starts with an M? Uh, well, I saw somebody else that had yeah, it. I saw it like three times. So just go ahead and say it because they'll scroll back up and yeah. make sure we got the first one. It's Melanie. Yeah. Number 87. The number, the number was 87. The number was 87. And it was Melanie. Congratulations, Melanie. Yay. That's awesome. Congrats, Melanie. Yep. yep. Right? It is definitely the first 87 I see. Yeah, it is. I saw it. Yep. Way. She's right after Evadine, then her, then Jamie, then Louise. And yep. It is you. Nice, Melanie. Very nice. Perhaps the awesome oh. winners. That was fun. It was fun. Super duper fun. All right. I'm going to pull it back over here just so that if it decides to grab the end as a screenshot, we can have something sort of kind of pretty to look at. Um, so yeah, we'll be back Monday night. Um, I'm going to start working on invoices tomorrow. So those should be out tomorrow and Saturday. And I have no idea what's planned for Monday night yet. So if you guys have any special requests or fun ideas, shoot me a message or we'll yak about it over in Facebook on the group page. So thank you, Maggie. It was fun. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Stuff. Yeah. Thanks, Michelle. Thank you, ladies. Very welcome. Thank you, ladies. Thanks, Mags. Thanks, Patty. Oh, cool. Thank you, cool. Yep. I'll read it and I'll get back to you tonight or first thing in the morning. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna drag on and on. I'm just gonna say good night. Thank you. Everybody have a safe weekend and we'll see you Monday. Thanks for the quickies. Yeah. <laughs>